With my Lord's leave, my Lord, may I be allowed to mention for upgradation of appeal matter, my Lord. This matter, my Lord had the occasion to deal with the matter. Mm. It is relating to corruption in a panchayat body. Mm. My Lord, after dealing with the matter, specifically directed to give a report to the effect mm. why unnecessary lillians was given in not lodging a fire, in not conducting the matter. That matter was directed to appear on to first. Uh, it was directed that magistrate will not file a report not later than 21st December and to give a copy. And matter was directed to appear in earlier date, my lord. Neither in affidavit file, no copy it's sub. It's in the mon monthly list, is it? No, it is appearing in the different list meter is in the bottom position, my lord. What is the serial number? Number uh, Item number 106 of days list, my lord. We'll make a note. Huh? Babu Mistri. Babu Mr. Miller, this is my, I have also served a copy to the other side, Miller. Miller, please give the letter. Miller. Yes, Mr. Bossa. <coughs> Miller, this is a this is a part of matter. Oh, he's in it. Oh, okay. Yeah. Much obliged. Uh, matter, uh, Miller, uh, this is a part of matter uh, following Supreme Court order. Oh. And the last hearing was taken place on 3rd Jan. Uh, now the thing is in the suit premises is occupied by the trespassers now my son is getting married very soon mm -hmm. so there is a temple in that premises as a family ritual when the new bride comes then she goes to the temple first then she uh, enter into our house so you see until and unless this is taken up tomorrow as it is running in serial number 31 mat 22 48 so this is very very urgent my lord please 30 31 31 uh, maybe 31 32 i'm not sure yesterday's list it will come on Monday. Tomorrow it will come. Tomorrow, please. Much obliged. Much obliged. Yes. Uh, I seek my Lord's kind indulgence to move this matter, my Lord, uh, on Monday. Because on and from Monday, my Lord, the Dental Council election will commence. Mm -hmm. The state and my Lord, the Medical Council, they have foregone the point that the election petition maintainable. They considered to that on the point of law. Now, my Lord, I am a president of the Dental Council. Now, Milot, gadget notification was there. Milot, the, it has lost its force. Electoral role, Milot, lost its life. Even then, Milot, they are proceeding with the matter. And there is a videograph. The court held, Milot, that by way of an executive, Milot, uh, direction, Milot, the gadget can, notification can be revived. That is the No notice, it will come on Monday. I'm extremely so, we need to mention a rectification of the applicable mistake. Yes. Mm -hmm. Milot, we mention for inclusion on application my lord filing yes yes, yes. yes mr Sivar, sir uh, my lord with your kind permission my lord i had filed a pil on sandesh khali issue in supreme court and honorable supreme court had granted me liberty to file a pil before this honorable court that i filed my lord wpa number 104 of 2024 i'm only requesting that the same may be taken up on monday with the suomoto case my lord. 104 of 2024 Yes, my lord. My colleague is there in the courtroom, my lord. She'll pass on the uh, requisite documents. Yes. My lord. You give the number. Have you served notice? Yes. So we will be serving notice today. You serve notice today itself. Okay. It will be listed on Monday along with the that so motor matter. Huh? DP yes. of life. DP yes. of life. My lord will permit me to also appear through online, my lord. It's a yes, yes, list. yes. 100 percent, 100 percent. No problem. I'm deeply, deeply, deeply obliged. Gratefully yes. obliged. Yes. My Lord, may I be permitted to mention one matter, my Lord, heading application? Application, yes. May I take the kind leave to me, file an appeal without the certified copy, Your Lordship? Does. It is within within limitation? No, of the limitation, Your Lordship. The only problem, Your Lordship, I could have filed a Section 5 application. Now, the court is closed, Your Lordship. I have filed an application. Which court? Is court number 2, Your Lordship. Now, the file is in the court. I have. We can open it. I know that Lord yeah. this. but they are not hmm. Hmm. Tuesday you move the matter on Tuesday court will be open on Tuesday Lord this. Yeah. Hmm? may I have your Lordship sign leave <laughs> to file this appeal without the certified copy of the order your Lordship the order was passed last evening by Honorable Justice Kosi Chondo the only request I have is your Lordship the learned AG is leading me in this matter and there is some urgency if you what if... is the order passed Lordship, the order has been passed that a petitioner in the read petition is supposed to visit today in Sandesh Thali during, uh, during the time. Here, we, uh, we have got better business to do, sir. You file it. No urgency at all. Let somebody go, somebody not go. We are not. Please call the list. Look, one below. Yeah, spring code upgradation in the list below. 100. Monday, Monday. Upgradation yeah. includes. It's below the PIL matter below. 
Monday, Monday. Malad, I have an extreme Muslim mention, Malad. Well, this is pertaining to some observations made by your Lordships pertaining to a person who was not apprehended for a long time. Your Lordship had taken out a supplementary affidavit uh, list yesterday at 12 o'clock and subsequently the matter was heard again. You are appearing for that person? Yes, Malad. Wonderful. And we were waiting for your presence. Well, we did not know. In no, fact, no, Malad. no, no. If he has given you Vakalatnama, no. then, then his whereabouts are known. Malad, he's arrested. Okay. Huh? When he, when was Malad, he my instructions are he's been arrested this morning or late last night. But my issue was that my application for anticipatory paper was pending. It was heard out. It was dismissed two days back. Four applications are pending before the lower courts. They are yet pending. 42 cases are pending against you. None were, Malad. And for the next 10 years, mind it, you will have wonderful work. For the next 10 years, you will not have any time to handle any other brief. And this person, you will be the sole, uh, <laughs> and you have five, seven juniors. You have a big legal team and officers. He'll keep you busy for the next 10 years. Can I just pray for one indulgence, Malad? No. Uh, anything you want, you come on Monday. No, Malad. Uh, the thing is that my application for anticipatory bail, since it's rejected in the law. Right, let him be arrested. No, uh, he's Haven't already you? arrested. I no, can't no. file it before the regular bench in the high court. Because your lordship's observations are Monday, there. Monday, you please come on Monday. May I file the report? Uh, no, the this could, could be coming up in the regular. Right, Monday, Monday, sir. Monday. We have got no sympathy on that person. Yes, sir. Please, please, sir. I yes, just to file the, the appeal without Happy the satisfaction. Daily list, serial number one. You file it. You have to mention it. Get it released. Right. 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 No sympathy for this person. Fourth January is not, not allowed. Pass an order hmm. relating to illegal flying of the vehicle. Hmm. You are just to direct the state government to file a report. Let it reach. We'll see how we program today. If it appears to be mentioned, let the report be circulated to us so that we can go through it and we can do right. our submission on that. Uh, day. Let it be called out because government pleader is not here. Let it be called out. Yes, what is this item? Malad, uh, if your lordship kindly refer to the last one, is their application, Malad, for the betterment and uh, the cause of the street child, Malad. But uh, I have got the instruction. They are adequately taken care of. Lord, she wanted me to come back with an affidavit. This public spirited citizen has number of matters of different causes. So maybe, maybe he is very. Busy. Yes, Malad, but I am, Malad, I am, I have, I have prepared an affidavit, Lord. Ship. I need a week that more time. It is all has not been served. Yes, Malad, it is. It is, no, it is in the process. It is the in the process. Eleven December, my lord, you. Gave the direct, actually, yes. the respondent advocate took time for that. All right, we'll give him one more opportunity. My Lord, huh? my Lord I also have the supplementary affidavit as per the verbal direction but, of this honorable right. court uh, to the, provide a report. The respondent state is granted by, uh, by 13th March. Yes, my Lord. List the matter in the same caption. On 14th March. My Lord, at least uh, accept this supplementary so, affidavit. Come on, 14th March, right, definitely. What is, what is the supplementary affidavit? This is as per the direction of this honorable court. Then you serve copy. He has to come. Already this. served on 11th Jan. Right. Just I want to submit this report. Right. Even my Lord, my affidavit is ready. Only the copy is needed to be ready. Taken on record. Next. Serial number 2. I beg to accept that This matter, my Lord, relates to my Lord, construction on the bank of River Ganga, my Lord. So this matter, my lord, relates to my lord, the construction on the bank of River Ganga, my lord. Hmm. Now, my lord. In this matter, my lord, what happened? A big project was going on on the bank of Ganga, my lord. The there was a one canal, which canal conjoins entire moistural area that was filled up. Several water body was filled up for the purpose of raising construction. Now, my lord, will kindly, my lord, take table to look at, at first, my lord. Where, where is your representation? Let us see your representation. Yes, my, lord, my representation is there, my lord. Page? Page 355. 335. 55, no? 335, brother. 335. Whether they passed any order? On the no, no, my lord. No, my lord. And who is the authority who granted uh, planning permission? Well, several authorities are there, my lord. No, no, no. Well, it's a, it's a, if it is a RERA project. If it is, my lord. RERA, R-E-R-A. -E. It's a RERA project. Yes. Correct? Yes, sir. It is a RERA. Yes, yes. It's it's a RERA. My lord, huh? my lord, I'm appearing for respondent number 14, my lord. My lord, this is my construction project, my lord. We have obtained 
all necessary permissions from the various authorities my lord there are certain documents that need to be brought in record before the learn first let them consider the representation which authority will consider mr sidi a please come to page 335 335 <laughs> I think Malad, the land department, the district land and land reforms office is sort only for permanent Malad. Because at all there is a conversion or not? No, according to him, uh, it is very close to Ganga. The, uh, the commissioner, is, uh, minister of Jalo Shakti department of water resources, one. Malad, because there are my lot one circle are my lot. So the commissioner, ministry of Jal Shakti. Department of Water Resources is that uh, authority a respondent in your petition? Yes, third respondent. Yes, third respondent. Man. Third respondent will consider after notice to all concerned. By this petition, the petitioner alleges. So, so oh, this is the central department, New Delhi. My Lord, can you allow us to submit an affidavit in opposition? Also, <laughs> we should be responding on five. Then you want a cancellation of the planning permission. Planning permission was granted by municipality. Ninth respondent. Yes, madam. Yes, madam. I am for the municipality. All right. By you are for the municipality. Yes, madam. Uh, by this written petition, the petitioner alleges that the fourteenth respondent has uh, is developing a project. which is clo close to river ganga and uh, there are serious violations of the environmental norms the prayer so uh, sought for in the writ petition is to cancel the planning permission which has been granted uh, you know uh, granted which should have been granted by the ninth respondent namely the mahestala municipality the learned advocate for the 14th respondent submitted that all necessary approvals have been obtained by the 14th respondent and the writ petition is devoid of merits at this juncture we are not inclined to go into the allegations made by the writ petitioner but would take note of the fact that a representation has been given by the petitioner to the various authorities including the ninth respondent municipality on 4 12 which is still pending therefore without going into the merits of the allegations made there will be a direction to the ninth respondent to consider the representation dated 4 12 after notice to the 14th respondent and pass a recent order and communicate the same to the writ petitioner within 3 weeks from the date of receipt of the server copy of this order in order to facilitate the compliance of this direction the petitioner is directed to enclose a copy of the representation dated 4 12 along with other connected documents other, uh, along with other relied upon documents uh, as well as the copy of this order to the ninth respondent for compliance of the above direction we make it clear that the merits of the allegation made by the petitioner against the 14th respondent have not been gone into next बेंगल एक्साइज respondents were granted bail by the court below now i am before your lordships my lord with a very humble prayer that when a statute says that no alcohol without could be sold sold my lord without any license and that to minor my lord this statutory mandate my lord when it is violated with impunity my lord there is a clear aberration of law and mandamus can be issued my lord to compel the authority to close my lord the bar now my lord i would request your lordship my lord <coughs> with to uh, what is it is a It's a bar eating house, my lord, with a bar and selling alcohol, my lord. Club, which is selling and club loka and with the proximity, my lord, hospital, my lord, within five hundred meters, 
the the school the fashion institute and what has the excise authority done on your complaint millard the uh, millard excise authority has millard called they they, are, they were the private respondents were arrested they were taken into custody they were no, granted that is on <laughs> but 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 millard so far as millard the uh, closure of millard the uh, bar that is armed that, that is not with, without any that is running without license selling alcohol to the minors and there is also hookah also millard hookah bar but uh, hookah <clears throat> bars are uh, uh, prohibited not it? but uh, under the cigarette act millard that is millard there are certain restrictions that is they cannot uh, sell what it. is your instruction sir millard in in 2022 there were arrests made by the excise authorities those arrests was made in 2023 a fresh complaint has come the excise authority went there no such alcohol is being sold there my lord strict vigil is being kept over the place his complaint is now with regard to the hookah the hookah does not come within the no this, no this excise department my lord hmm? no ah. uh, see ah. when you conduct an inspection you cannot call them up and say sir we are all no, no. coming we have we have not done so much we are today at ah. 3 pm <laughs> please uh, it has to be a surprise okay. It has to be a surprise inspection. It, it has to it has to be a surprise All right. inspection. I have the I have the inquiry report. All right. Who appears for the eighth respondent? Appears for the eighth. Uh, Mr. Uh, Mukherjee uh, is in the. Ah uh, yes. Lord Sheep, I am on behalf of resp. Lord Sheep, I am on behalf of respondent number eight, nine, and ten. Lord Sheep. Lord Sheep, yes. kindly allow me to appear virtually. Lord Sheep. Yes, yes, virtually? yes. Lord Sheep. Uh, Lord Sheep. Lord Sheep. The the thing is that if I go over the writ petition with fine tooth comb, then it is revealed before me that the allegations are divided into two parts. One part is I do not have a valid license, and second part is I am selling al I am selling alcohol to the minor. These yes. are the allegations. Lord Sheep. Regarding the first allegation that I do not have the valid license. Lordship, in this regard, already one case has been registered by the excise authority, and this case is pending before the court of learned judicial magistrate and trial will be started. So, Lordship, regarding this case, after completion of the trial, the true fact will be revealed. Because, Lordship, no, no, by that, that examination is... in chief, by cross examination. Uh, please, please. Sorry for interruption, but uh, that is a case registered in the year 2022. Admittedly, on that day you did not have a license. That is a different matter. Prosecution will take its course. But as on date, if you don't have a license, you cannot vend alcohol. That's the that's the stand taken by the government also. Therefore, close down the premises. Apply for a license. Let them inspect. If you satisfy the conditions, they will grant you a license. Then lawfully you run the business. As on date, uh, Lordship, in, in in that event, because Lordship, I am not selling alcohol. All right. And Lord, not, then there is no problem at all. Finally, kind of record the second thing record. is that <laughs> se, second thing is that Lordship, uh, uh, I am uh, another allegation is I am selling alcohol to, and to tobacco also to the minors. Hmm. This is and Lord, most important thing is that in the in the read petition it is written that in the menu chart in the menu chart the alcohol or other uh, 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 right. things which is a uh, prohibited these well, things uh, have not been the mentioned. So Lordship, Bullard, why are... it will be mentioned because I'm not saying. Yes, Millard, There are two submissions, Millard. First is Millard, So far as the hookah is concerned, Millard, hmm. there is a mandamus appeal with regard to whether the hookah can be sold or not, Millard, in the Kolkata and the Vidhanagar Municipal Corporation area pending before my lords. Millard, that is one aspect. Millard, second aspect, Millard, here is, Millard, as the excise authority says so, and Millard, even we are not finding whether, whether they have a proper excise license per se, Millard, the selling of alcohol makes... With this distribution, style is the petitioner alleges that the respondents 8 to 10 are running a club and are selling alcohol without license and there is also a hookah bar. In the year 2022, the inspection was conducted and it was found that the respondents 8 to 10 were serving alcohol in the premises without a proper license. And therefore, criminal case has been registered and the matter is under progress. Uh, from the submissions made by the learned advocate appearing for the respondents 8 to 10, it appears that as, as on date, the respondents 8 to 10 do not have any excise license 
to to vend alcohol in the premises in question bolna beta thing sir kitni phone and date to date do not possess any license then vending of alcohol in the premises is illegal in the light of the representations given by the it petitioner more particularly dated 20th december 2023 will be direct the third respond to conduct a surprise inspection of the premises and if, if it is found that alcohol is being uh, sold in the said premises the premises be sealed forthwith However, this will not prevent the respondents eight to ten to apply for a license before the excise authorities before commencing any business with regard to vending of alcohol. The above the above direction be complied with within a period of three weeks from the date of receipt of survey. Next week. Next. Lawship may be permitted to make one submission. Lawship. Yes, please. Serial number four. Yes, yes. One second. Uh, yes yes she actually developed you will know you 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 obtain he is gone already lord well i'm sorry i reached a bit late my lord only one thing i needed to point out my lord the lease which has been given to the occupier of the building by the urban development department whom my learned friend is representing my lord that is for music and arts i have checked it so my lord uh, I under I have uh, been informed about order your lawyer is passing alert. Will kindly include that that the usage should be restricted to music and arts. For the if required, I can produce the deed also. The municipality shall also ensure that the usage of the building ah. is restricted the to the purpose. For, for the corporation, I am for the corporation. Ah, for corporation. Ah. Uh, the usage of the building is restricted to the purpose for which lease was granted. My lord. Next. Till number four. Till four. Malad, in this matter, Malad, Malad, in this matter, Mr. Pinaki Ranjan Chakravarti is appearing for the Malad petition. Malad, Malad, I am praying for two weeks time due to severe Malad sleep disc, disc Malad illness. Malad, he has not come to the court. Malad, two weeks time actually. On the on the ground of uh, ill health of the learned advocate for the petitioner, adjourned by four weeks. Next, serial number five uh, for the petition. Five Malad, I beg to appear for the state responding lordship. And on the last occasion, Malad, lordship's pleasure was to direct okay. me. That's that whether great. you can find out a solution that there is a common playground which can be used by the existing school as well as by the upcoming millard integrated millard english school uh, english medium school lot sure that is exactly the solution has been arrived at millard as it appears millard from the dm report given to me millard may i just millard respectfully millard you give copy to them and over lot sure uh, without going into the detail millard may i state our millard respectfully millard by invite your lot sheets you know, to come to page 2 of the report lot sheets Hmm. At the bottom, page two, my lord. At the bottom, according to the sketch map, the length of the proposed school building is sixty point five meter and breadth is twenty two meter. After using the land for construction of school building, an area of fifty three meter into forty five point nine seven meter will be left vacant, which can be used as common playground of both Akri Ganj High School, that is the petitioner, and the proposed my lord English medium high school. So this is the Miller solution arrived at. It's a win-win situation. There was a meeting. The headmaster of the council school was also there at the meeting. Yeah, that is also a government-funded institution. Yes, yes. Lot sheet. So both, this both, is the both are the government-funded. So Miller exactly this is the Miller solution when, arrived at. In terms of right to education act and rules, that was their duty to provide okay. playgrounds. Secondly, Miller, may I just Miller make one respectful submission, Lot sheet? <laughs> lot sheet, may kindly may may I respectfully may invite your Lot sheet, Miller. The last order, Miller, passed by your Lot sheet. On twenty second, my lord, February, my lord, twenty twenty four. Lordy, there was an observation made, my lord, in paragraph two, my lord. If I may respectfully, my lord, read out. It is submitted that there is a proposal to construct an integrated English medium school in the said land, and the grievance of the petitioners is that if the same is permitted, the playground which is presently used by the students of school will lose its character. And taking note of the fact 
it is a government sponsored school the gram panchayat has spent public fund for construction of the stadium as on date we know this but allow me this observation was made by lordship when my learned friend had me lord referred to me lord page 29 me lord of the repetition me lord mm. which was in a bengali vernacular mm. but me lord may i just me lord respectfully me lord invite your lordship me lord to no, page 29 one no stadium yes. no st kindly see the me lord the content of the letter me lord is a bengali vernacular me lord page 29 me lord me lord let your lordship go through the contents me lord so there is two english three english words one says huh. earthen stadium Another says resolution. Author, my lord, may I author lordship? Uh, may I read out for my lord, my lord justice, my lord, but a charge lordship that author, uh, abe na GP, theke pokho theke shidham to grihu to huye chhe. Je akhiri gaon high school er halar mathe ekti adam stadium toiri kora hoyi be. Yes, yes. Taai high school kothi pokro pokho theke resolution shaho onumoti permission potro poryojon. Taai apna ke ekti অনুমতি পত্র পারমিশন দেবার জন্য অনুরোধ করিতেছি যাতে আমরা আরদেন স্টেডিয়াম তৈরির জন্য প্রয়োজনীয় ব্যবস্থা গ্রহণ করতে পারি এন্ড দ্যাট এন্ড দ্যাট হ্যাজ বিন কনস্ট্রাক্টেড ইন ফিউচার মি লর্ড দ্যাট হ্যাজ বিন দ্যাটস অফ 2018 উই আর ইন 2024 দ্যাট হ্যাজ বিন কনস্ট্রাক্টেড আই হ্যাভ দ্য পিকচার মি লর্ড সো ফার অ্যাজ আন্ডার गवर्नमेंट প্রজেক্ট লর্ড শে মি আই জি টু সাবমিট ইউ শুড নট ডিসকাস দিস কোড প্লিজ সো ফার অ্যাজ দ্য প্রজেক্ট প্রেজেন্ট প্রজেক্ট ইজ কনসার্ন মি লর্ড ইট ইজ টেকিং প্লেস me lord me i my lord just me lord refer to me lord that cbsc provides or me me lord me the cbsc provides over 8000 square meter for construction of our lord building school building the present project involves two plots that is 271 and 272 total quantum of land is 1 acre 22 me lord decimal so this is where me lord the project is me lord is coming up. the dm's report does not say anything about the stadium lordship so me lord but, but, but we lord. have the documents to show you for lordship if the but, stadium is there they will not yeah, me lord yes let us simplify the procedure lordship <laughs> by this repetition uh, so kindly clarify that part lordship filed by persons uh, who are interested in protecting the playground used by the children of the akri ganj school oh. had opposed the construction of an integrated english medium school in the land which has been used as a playground it was uh, pointed out that the panchayat has spent for public funds for construction of a stadium in the said playground which has been used by the students on 22 2024 the court made certain suggestions to the learned government council and directed specific instructions to be obtained pursuant that to a report has been submitted by the district magistrate murshidabad and the penultimate portion of the report dated 28 2 2024 is as follows so the report page 2 last paragraph according to the sketch mark sure so <clears throat> considering the fact that construction of an english integrated english medium school is also required for the children in the, in the area and balancing the interests of both parties namely protecting the uh, namely providing sufficient place to be used as a playground by the akirganj high school students as well as by the students who will be admitted to the proposed integrated english medium school come on the suggestions which were made has been well taken and the above report has been submitted the the respondents would dispute as regards the construction of the stadium however the the learned advocate for the petitioner submitted that in the year 2018 there was a proposal by the gram panchayat and the stadium has been put in place be that as it may since the proposed construction of the integrated english medium school would not affect the an extent of 53 meters into 45.97 meters which has been agreed to be left vacant to be used as a common playground for both the schools come we we are of the view that no further directions are required in the in this repetition except to observe 
that the district magistrate Murshidabad shall ensure um, proper compliance of what had been stated in the report dated 28-2-2024 and <laughs> permit the students of both the schools to use the common playground. <clears throat> With the above observations, extremely good. Next, Next. Lord, may the DMS, the DMS report be kept on record. Yes, the DMS report. Next, serial number six. I'm appearing for the petitioner. Hmm. The petitioner challenged the impugned notification dated uh, 23rd February 2021, where the respondent number seven was appointed as the chief administrative officer. At present, her rank is joint register. For that post, as per their rules, uh, sub rule four, rule three of the West Bengal State Council of Technical and Vocational Education and Skill Development Rules 2019, which I have annexed in page 24, mm. where it is reflected that the post of chief administrative officer shall be not below the rank of joint secretary mm. to the government in the appropriate scale of state. My lord, this is a case of corruption and red tape. My lord, kindly cease. Page 24. <laughs> I have also annexed the profile of the respondent number seven. And according to you, <clears throat> what is the post held by the present incumbent? At this moment, joint register, which is much below the rank of joint secretary. How do you say that? Is the profile? What is the pay band? What is the pay band of both the posts? Well, pay band is not the fact. Pay band is not the fact. Rank a bank is the fact, sir. No, my lord. How do you equate two posts? One is a joint registrar, one is a joint secretary. Yes. If you say that the post of joint registrar is not equivalent to that of the joint secretary, the only way you can distinguish it is by producing the pay bank, <laughs> saying that it is in a lower grade. What is your well, yes, well, I have taken instructions, my lord. The pay band of this lady, my lord, of is scale 19. Now, my lord, this has been done by way of a uh, uh, notification of 3rd December 2019. Mm -hmm. There is a notification memorandum of the government of West Bengal of 18 June 2013, which says my lord, scale band of 19 is equivalent to an ex officio joint secretary. See, sir, and I can see, hand it over, my lord. My respectful and my lord will kindly see. May, may, may I finish? Is holding the scale of district uh, magistrate, he may be deputed as the district no, magistrate. I have only got one question to us. You ask a question to us. Yeah. I only have one copy. Yeah. I'm sorry, my lord. Just to be clear. Those are different documents. My lord, those are two different documents. Appointment of the private respondent as the chief administrative officer. On the ground that <laughs> the, the incumbent has not held the post of joint secretary. Thank you. Learn it. Gown Pleader has produced the memorandum hmm, dated 3rd November 2019, showing that the post of joint registrar of cooperative West Bengal Cooperative Service uh, is in pay scale, pay band, pay scale number 19. Huh? And, uh, and well, that, that shows pay scale 19. Like to both grade with 18. Pay scale 19, that is that notification. And the memorandum has gone to my Lord Justice. What a judge, Joe Mallet. And everything is this let the them pay. direct to file the FED. It will be better. Second paragraph. Second, there is a question of corruption and red tape is in. And that department the of second, Polytechnic. Second paragraph, Mallet. Uh, it is detrimental for the public at large. Malad. They need to file the FED. Let them file FED. May I read out my some uh, some parts? The Honorable uh, Governor uh, was pleased to decide in partial modification of the department memo dated 28-12-2012 to allow the designation of ex-office joint secretary during posting the secretariat on such movement to the pre-registered for officers of the state constituted service <laughs> from whom scale in the designation has been allowed. Thus, we find no illegality in the appointment of the private respondent as chief administrator of the state. Thank you. Next. Serial number seven. Yes, sir. Seven. I wish to appear for the A large number of people in the district of Nudia are aggrieved with the misappropriation of their funds 
well at again smile of the respondent number seven and eight not only that my lord i am very much specific on my my lord complaint in page number seven zero seventy my lord my lord not only that the recruitment scam also there the said my lord the organization as my lord made the recruitment process only for a pick and choose process without any eligibility criteria my lord there is a deposition of my lord public fund and completely misappropriated and my lord when they claim for this money my lord all this my lord this money has not been existed in this my lord their passbook my lord your lordships on and last what, occasion what happened to your complaint appeared my lord uh, this uh, respondent number 7 and 8 not represented your lordship directed to my lord serve i have my lord serve my lord service is ready my lord my lord what, i have 7 and 8 <laughs> my lord kindly my lord uh, where, where is the acknowledgement of your representation page 70 you have sent it by speed post my lord my lord uh, we have already registered an fir on the basis of that on the basis of the representation the 24th then what about uh, uh, recovery of the money which was siphoned off etc uh, that my lord because my lord i am for because... 7 and 8 uh. my lord let me come please allow me to come technically first the affidavit that which has been found by the incumbent concerned, mm. he doesn't stay at the address that which is given in the affidavit and even in the uh, first title two. He says CRPF camp, Chandra. He had period. been there, but he is no longer there. He has retired and he has come back. And my lord, to this, I would give you a bunch of papers mm. that which would show that letters were given to him because he was awarded under Section 139 of the West Bengal Community Societies Act for recovery of money. That particular incumbent itself. So he is a defaulter. He is a defaulter, my lord. And that the letter were, was sent to his address, that which was given here. Hmm. The award was sent to that address and it has come back with the note that he is no longer there. Hmm. Sure. The track reports are also given there, my lord. But track report says item delivered. No, sir. That that, second time. Delivered to us. In the very few lines under that, it is given that it is returned. And what about this uh, FIR which has been registered? Beg your pardon, my lord? Just recently registered, my lord. Investigation is going on. The FIR the, has been registered. On 24th of January. Yes, my lord. And more so, the local more so, my lord, newspaper. May I please, my lord, been, my lord, registered. My lord, and please. After my lord, the allegation. My lord, I'm getting interrupted. Lord, inevitable, my lord, I will be defaulted. But uh, there is an award <laughs> against you. you are, no, no, you have to challenge the award. Otherwise, they'll attach your property. There is an award against your client. Uh. My lord, one of the client, one of the my lord, this petitioner, one of the petitioner. But my lord, I will, my lord. Challenge, my lord. That is, my lord, only for the personal interest. My lord, in may I case, be allowed to go to the next point, please? Pa, pa, sorry, I'm not one. Palash Ghosh. Right, my lord. Took the house repairing loan, 25 lakhs, at the rate of so-and-so. Did not repay. Sent several notices. As on date. None of the fetra kiya chai. So-and-so, so-and-so. No, not 25 lakhs. As on date, total loan uh, outstanding is 3 lakhs, 93,000, 4. Right, my lord. And award is communicated, but he has left this place and he is an ex serviceman not residing in the CRPF. My lord, the parcel, the last page, my lord, this notice, the last page of the recruitment, he has given a representation. My lord, this type of several issues because my lord, the authority concern. If you are a defaulter, then there is some personal interest in this litigation. My lord, only one person. Only one person. He is that Malad, because Malad, because, because my lord kindly Malad, please allow me. My lord kindly appreciate the person Malad, authority concern. I am getting interrupted. Malad, money, whose appointment is in question, question my lord. Because my lord. All right. He, he, all, all right. His appointment is. My lord, I I will be ready to ready to my lord face my my lord the private interest my lord in my lord the proper part. In Malad, this case, there are two more documents supporting another person in the in the petition itself. Fifty crores of money, my lord, misappropriation of funds. Already case they are after only. They will take care. Case has been registered. My uh, lord, the next issue may please be seen. Gone in. Yes, fifty-four of two thousand four, uh, Navadi Police Station, on twenty-four one twenty twenty-four. 
and my lord they have taken i mean they have taken bail on that also the fir the copy of the fir is with me by this red petition filed as a public interest litigation by my lord can we go to the other sheet yes 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 we will and go that actually he is incumbent concern poltu ghosh all right all right is one of the petitioners he called he submitted false certificate by seven seven persons uh alleges that the 7th and 8th respondents have committed large scale fraud um in the in the manner in which the particular society had conducted its affairs therefore action is being sought for a uh, therefore representation was submitted to take immediate action and since the representation has not been considered the pet petitioners have filed this writ petition the learned uh, government council submitted that that uh, based on the written complaint received uh, from the writ petitioner on 24 1 a case has been registered in now navadip ps in case number 54 of 2024 dated 24 1 for alleged offenses under section 420 406 and 34 ipc against several persons uh, which include the respondents uh, 7 and 8 and the and the case is under investigation the learned advocate appearing for the respondents 7 and 8 submitted that two of the petitioner namely the the Sixth and the seventh writ petitioner, namely Pintu Ghosh and Palash Ghosh, are both have both availed loans from the society, and they are defaulters. And in respect of Mr. Palash Ghosh, the an award has been passed on twenty five five twenty twenty three for recovery of a total amount of rupees three comma ninety three comma four five zero. and the said award was communicated to the address which is given in this writ petition uh, in the affidavit sworn to by the by palash ghosh and the communication had returned to this sender to the endorsement that uh, the that palash ghosh does not in any uh, does not reside in the said premises furthermore uh, palash ghosh has given a letter to the uh, branch manager of the society on 15 2 uh, 2024 stating that he is he lives in navadip in a village named baramnagar and uh, uh, baramnagar or therefore the address given in the affidavit filed uh, in this writ petition is a false address be that as it may since already a case has been registered by the police and investigation has commenced we direct the concerned police authorities <clears throat> to conduct a thorough investigation in the matter uh, in ps number 54 of 2024 and bring to books those persons who had committed illegality the <clears throat> the respondents 5 and 6 shall also call for the records from the concerned society and examine as to the correctness of the transactions which have been done the recruitments which have been conducted etc and proceed to take action in accordance with law with the above directions the reporting is dispatched my lord may i have a copy of the fir my lord kindly give me no no that only one ask your friend next pile number 8 grateful you lord that this matter was hard on the earlier day that there was a peel matter my and my lord india sukos notice given ah yes pre decided my lord yes lord 123 and yes yes we remember lord i have taken my lord a, a translated copy of english for your lord sir yes before your lord sir takes up the peel my lord probably but i have a point of maintainability here my lord because my lord your lord sir understands i am representing the government my lord but well, he is espousing his personal cause here saying that he has received a notice 
where his property so the explanation given was manat, the notice is a consequence of no, the first it is not secondly manat if you see his prayers manat very important where manat he is wanting himself to be added to that writ petition that can't be done that's already that's been. gone so manat kindly see his prayers manat i'll just point it out manat he wants to vary and modify that order manat, that cannot that be done be here done. now we are only on the short issue but the short issue is this was not done on the basis of your lordship's order very good i will just point out why malat but i on the last occasion justice bhattacharya told me to inform my clients not to take malat kindly see he has challenged a notification the first notification which is challenged based upon thank you no malat that notification one ticket it is at page 293 malat in the okay yes sir i must also point out my learned friend has also gone for the hearing filed hajira there I was not noticed, Malad. But a two ninety three Malad is a correction notification. Why, Malad? After a vesting notice is passed hmm. under Section four of the West Bengal Estate Acquisition Act, Malad, all properties and especially a heart under Section five A two gets vested into the state. Now, while looking through the records, Malad, there has been certain records. Which have not shown the vesting. One of them is my learned friend's property. So therefore, for correction of record of rights, Malad, the notice was issued. Now, what does the notice say? Notice says under Section Five, read with Section Four, the property automatically stands vested. Therefore, we are undertaking a correction. You come and give a take a hearing. So Malad, the finding that Malad, it is a, a vested. property malad that is automatic because of the act ah. so it is not any further finding or so, conclusion uh, they will not have an opportunity to contest that finding that they cannot so first another notice was there and they will come malad they can come and show but we have got records on the, uh, i mean on documents to show malad that won't be available i'll point out why malad but then i can file an affidavit or such once malad But what in a GR proceeding, the property was retained. I know, my lord. That only one thing, my lord. Two ninety-three first paragraph. My lord, yes, yes. Last sentence. My lord. Do you have any document in support of that? Moreover, the intermediaries has provided. My lord, my lord, I'm missing it. But kindly, kindly, allow me, my lord. I just can't find it, my lord. First, first paragraph. paragraph, last sentence. Moreover, start yes. from moreover. Yes, my lord. The intermediaries has provided under section six of. But other yes. Do you have any document to not for him, Malad? For others, we can. Yes, yes. Regard to this, not this, Malad. No, this is a this is a notice. This yes, is yes. We have for others. Yes. So for, for this petitioners are concerned, Malad. That is document. To I show. cannot, Malad. That is what I'm saying, Malad. Can it appreciate? There is a wrong which has been done because Malad they applied for retention of a heartland, which Malad kindly takes section five, Malad, of the West Bengal Estate Acquisition Act, Malad. According to you, who are that they? was wrongly done? Who are they? Well, they were the intermediaries, but they did not have right after this act, Malik. Yes. Kindly takes Malik Section Five. Malik, I'm just a little bit there, Malik. May I read, Malik? Upon the due publication of a notification under Section Four, Malik Section Four, Malik notification has been passed, Malik. I have that copy. That is not a problem. And on and from the date of vesting, the estate and rights of intermediaries in the estates to which the declaration applies <clears throat> shall vest in the state free from all encumbrances, in particular with the prejudice or general the provisions of this clause. Every one of the following rights which may be owned by an intermediary shall vest in the state, namely, what can you see? Two rights in hearts. So this came automatic. But then what happened? They section six. Yes, my lord. Section six, yes, Malad. Yes, retention. He does a document to show Malad. that this was not allowed to be retained. Malad, that is the no mistake. That is the mistake which has been done, Malad. Let us uh, show. I'm agreeing to that, Malad. That they have been allowed to retain. Yes. That is why the correction of record of rights. That is why the hearing. So according to you, it's a retained land. According to me, it was wrongly retained, allowed to retain, to be retained. That is retained land. That is as on date. Can you now reopen that issue? Malad, yes, Malad, because it's a correction of the record of rights. Not by way of correction merely. So you have to take a decision. 
pass an order with regard to vesting. Have, Malad, you, have you done so? Show us the order of vesting. Malad, the order of vesting is automatic. Malad, the consequence, Mr. Malad, the vesting is automatic. That is true. But retention is there. You Malad, said, according to you, they were wrongly allowed to retain. Malad, so now you have to set the clock back. Yes, Malad, that is why the hearing. Show us, prime FSC, show us that you have taken a decision, that decision has been taken, that this was wrongly allowed to be retained, and this is the order by... Well, that is why the but notice says so. Notice says so. Notice is with regard to correction. No, no. Well, the notice, correction is the consequence. Notice, no, man. Notice specifically says that in view of these provisions of the Act, it stands automatically vested. Therefore, we are undertaking a correction. Notice is issued to all the hearts within the state of West Bengal. Well, wherever the notifications have been passed, my that is why I have shown the circular 293. So in all these cases... That is what is being... Happened. That is what... Yes, whatever the mistakes are. This was a decision taken at the highest level. Malad, so can you sh uh, show us the decision? Malad, this the circular was issued pursuant to a lordship's order. And any inquiries made? Yes, in these uh, plots, these mistakes were uh, made. Malad, that is the inquiry which is being undertaken. taken a point of maintenance of the uh, public interest litigation, but this court can take judicial... Malad, 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 the Malad, various notices... Throughout the state of West Bengal has been issued. Yes, Malad. Types of notices. Malad, that is why 293. Public interest litigation. Malad, Malad in 293. Malad, I am not on that. The I took the basis. point, Malad. If your lordship has taken me, I miss for that. I am sorry. But I took that point only for a simple reason, Malad. Malad, because he was espousing his personal cause. That is why. Considering because I am trying to stop the number of public interest litigations on a lighter side, Malad. Considering the extent and your I, know, Malad, I am addressing your lordship on the merits. Of the state with regard to this. And I am addressing your lordship on the merits, Malad. Your lordship can definitely draw a public interest side of it. I am on the point, Malad. 293 is the circular which recognizes that mistake and says that corrections have to be done. So, what? therefore, that retention has to be undone. Malad, that is only by that... correction. No. And, Malad, also he has a right of. But I'm not taking this point here, Lordship kindly understands. If it is a wrong, then he has to apply. It's a scheduled act, Malad, also. He has the right of appeal. He doesn't do that. He comes up and says... So is the order allowing retention in respect of this? Malad, that he has... Yes, Malad, um, yes. Your Lordship kindly look to the order. Page, uh, page, my Lord. Hmm. That is to eat. Yeah. Last page page 43. 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 Page I have the translated. I've got a translated copy. Give us the translated copy. Oh, this, uh, uh, yes. That, uh, that should be, my lord. My lord, 895, lord, see, page 56. Page 56, my lord, towards the bottom, 895. We are concerning to the extent of 895. 895. Yes. That's the only plot, my lord. Our case is restricted only to so this. This was allowed to be retained. Yes, my lord. So where is the order? That uh, uh, setting aside this or quashing this, recalling this order. Malad, that is. Otherwise, you cannot uh, uh, correct the record of rights unless this order is modified. Malad, under the. Malad, with humanity, Malad, I am not very. Malad, your lordship will kindly see. Correction of record of rights, Malad, is. About retention. That's the decision taken. Malad, that is why. I kindly come to pay, uh, section 6. Malad. Lord, not with a standing five, four and five. Not with a standing clause, my lord, section six, one, four and five. Starts with a non obstante clause. Yes, well, yes. Anything contrary to section four and five, any intermediary shall. Shall. Except in the cases mentioned in the proviso to subsection two, but subject to other provisions, be entitled to retain with effect from the date of vesting. Well, because they, they have exercised their option and you have allowed them well, to retain. This section six, my lord. If your lordship kindly sees section six, when section six specifies, my lord, what can be retained. Yes. So now, 
now they have exercised their option of retention malad and you have allowed that i say malad for a heart it is not possible to exercise retention but you have allowed them so malad. you have to first correct this order that is a correction malad yes no, not the record of rights mr rai that is the consequence malad the that decision. is malad that decision is at this stage malad i propose correction of the record of rights he has to come and show why not without modifying can you correct the record of rights well that record of rights correction is to give an effect to a decision of retention that, or vesting whatever it might that is why i'm sub saying alert unless you have allowed them to retain malad, unless this order is modified this order first of all malad 69 yes dot page 291 dot paragraph 5 this order 91 paragraph 5 Got the BC that was passed in the year nineteen sixty-nine. Yes, it was. And they have enclosed a certificate copy which they have. But I am not disputing that. So therefore, the first, you you are right, Gun Peter. If suppose this order is modified as Lachupan is set aside as being illegal, consequently you have to correct the record of it. Yes. So the show cause notice should should be for the purpose of modifying this order. Saying that for such 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 reasons, mm -hmm. this land could not have been allowed to be a retained land, and because 1969 it took place, yes. and you are trying to reverse it now. Yes, man. Only, only altering the consequential. See, once it is allowed to be retained, this order should uh, be set aside, and if it is set aside, they have got probably a right of appeal against that, etc. They can go for the tribunal Malad. also. Or file a suit. Something is there. Then you can, as a consequence, saying I have set aside the 1969 order. So therefore, I will alter the record of rights, and it will vest with the state free from all encumbrances. My lord. So this mistake. Uh, and what I am submitting, my lord. This order stands. My lord. Cannot treat this to be a vested land you because can... you have allowed this to be retained. So long as this order stands. Malad, show us that this order was modified. I am not saying that, Malad. What I am not modified can Malad, you treat this to be a vested land and direct correction. What purpose will be served? What they can show? Malad, that they can they will have to come and deal on the uh, the law, the legal part. No, this is in their favor. You have not taken. This is in their favor. I am saying under the Act, Malad. But your notice is not that that Malad, there is a mistake in the. Uh, Malad, one thing, Malad, kindly appreciates. No, no, I, you withdraw the notice and issue a proper notice. Malad, kindly sees the notice, Malad. Kindly sees the notice. That is translated copy has been. Yes, it has been given to you, Lachhi Malad. But in this supplementary yeah. affidavit, we have page eight, <laughs> page eight and nine. These are the two notices, Malad, given. Already finding is arrived at. Only consequential. Yes, the hearing. Page one hundred twenty-two about hearing notices. But page one twenty. Here to show cause. Three and twenty-three. So this is in English page fifty-three. Oh my, I don't know. This is in English. This was the notice issued. Fifty-three. At page six uh, A of the supplementary affidavit. I have not got one at report. Thank you. Thank you. Also, yeah. uh, that is also there in English. <laughs> One notice is there in English. Six A. Six A. Is vested. How do you say this? Man, that's the reasoning there after man. Yes. By conjoint operation of section four and five, by virtue of notification of nineteen fifty six. In the Calcutta Gazette, as it about it or no? What are they? What are they? What are they? Six is not the notice. Page ten, ten, page ten. Are they all? Six is not that. Six is not. No. Page ten. What are this was the other one? What are they? Where it was set aside because there was a finding of it was not under that. What are they? By effect of operation of law. What are they? Your contention is it stood vested. Yes. But this act came into the force in the year 1953. Probably vesting took place by notification issued Malad. subsequently. Malad. But in the year 1969, Malad. post coming into force of this act, Malad. his case was considered along with others, and he was permitted to retain. Malad. Suppose that retention order was an illegal order according to you. That order has to go. 
so he has to be put on notice if you propose to revoke the order permitting him to retain the land despite notification under this act you should say this error has occurred show us why this order of 1969 should not be rescinded and the land deemed to be vested in the state free from income then he will put up his case put up his documents <laughs> etc on what basis that retention order was passed then you pass an order probably well, will, cancelling the retention well, order. will your lordship kindly keeps it next week and then i'll try and find out whether the order has been passed or not let me just come back on that yes that you i think need, that is best you get the original i'll take it i'll take the malat uh, uh, no no lord we have said there is no order no notice was given no, to us for satisfaction let him get it so no, that, only uh, adjournment in this notice should have said that by virtue of this order okay. that original yes. order of 69 that was not said Prime Minister, it does not appear, and only one thing: you kindly take instructions because this is a decision has to be taken at the highest level. Yes, yes. What is the basis? Because in all matters, several uh, notices are being issued, and various proceedings are pending. But the because... first first point where it came from is your Lordship's order in that public investigation. If you say so, show us where that uh, did it say so. No. If you, but the notice point... do not say. that pursuant to that order it has been issued malad the miss case says so malad in this this malad is a page 120 so show us that uh, 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 mr government to just show us that there was a declaration of law in the said order that all huts and bazaars stood vested by virtue of that show us the declaration so it is not that so malad there your lordship held that huts which are on vested land rather the other way round any any um, you can straight away come to that order yes yes mother that, that page 291 291, 291 the last paragraph is 5 and straight away come to page is 5 paragraph 5 and 6 paragraph 5 yes, and 6 it says needless to say that if the classification is hard hard and, and it, is, it a, is a vested land and Malik. it is a vested land Malik. because it can be vested it cannot be vested mm. Well, and that so, is what i'm saying mother so there was no universal declaration that no, all Malik. it was not on bazaars Should be asked after your lot ship. Exactly order. what you have done after your lot ship's order, Malad. When the act was looked into, Malad, it appears that all hearts. No, <laughs> all hearts stand. Could not have been, uh, Mr. Gopal Peter. Could not have been a reading of section four, five, and six and of six. the West Bengal Act. Also, six. There is a provision for retention. Malad, not hearts. Allow retention. Not hearts, Malad. That is what we are on. Oh. We are only on that, Malad. Hearts are not. Okay. Lord Hearts, Lord, I have got a Lord Five Bench Judgment of the Supreme Court. Heart and Bazaar is an user by the proprietor of the land. Can you, Lord, see who will look into that? Lord, how he can no, say no, that? No, no. Let Let Count Peter get in section. Ashu, did not see it. So, see, in the judgment, sir, the land is government. And look at it, sixty-one Supreme Court. One Supreme. The government, sir, we I am we are recording your preliminary objection with regard to the mentality or what you say. No, we will not take. Well, it keeps that. Or it's not happening. Well, preliminary objection. All schedule acts will come before your lordship. Well, takes a uh, preliminary objection with regard to the mentality of this petition as a public interest litigation. So, sir, however, considering the fact that the uh, where does the notice say of this order? Show us the right, of which order? Says about the order passed in the public. By your lordships. Yes, hundred twenty-two. Hundred twenty-two. One twenty-two. Yes, my lord. The first line. Oshim Mangu Shankar, Bhumiya Bhumi Shankar, I never more man no kodi katha high courted. WPP two sixty-three of twenty twenty-one with I S H and such. Kodi krek pek hite fifty-one uh, A four A. Never considering the fact that a notice. Uh, no, uh, considering the fact that a miscase was initiated. Pursuant to uh, an order passed in a public interest litigation, being WPA within bracket P, two sixty three of twenty twenty one, and also that similar types of notices have been issued on the basis of such order. Come on, this court is of the prime facie view that this writ petition can be entertained as a public interest litigation. 
खुश रखो पैरक रखो The Lordnet government did a submit that after the order was passed in the public interest litigation, the authorities, after taking into consideration the provisions contained in section four and five of the West Bengal Estate Acquisition Act, nineteen fifty three, was of the view that all huts and bazaars within the state of west bengal to vested with effect from the date of issuance of notification under section 4 of the said act mr uh, 2435 however on a query of the court as to whether the intermediaries could retain Hearts and bazaars yeah. under the provisions laid down in Section Six of the Said Act, from the Lanet Government leader, sought an adjournment to assist this court on the next occasion. Sorry, uh, as paid for. By the Lanet government leader, list this matter. Yes, next week. What? In the next week. As a main writ application, that's also pending before Lordship because some recalling application has been filed. Of in, respect, in respect of the earlier WPA, in which your Lordship order was passed, while well, the recalling then that was fixed yesterday, that couldn't take an up. But, but, you are a party. In, you yes, are a party we, in we are the we are the petitioners there. And that was fixed yesterday, Malala. That was not taken. So since he has asked for recalling, recalling they applications have, have been filed there. They have asked for recalling in this. Therefore, I think they. Malala, we have come with contempt application because portion of your lordship's order that has been complied with regarding demolition of the building, which has been constructed over the vested land. In the next day also. Well, on next Thursday. Or can. Malala, 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 Since this court, uh, no, since the issue as to whether the lands in question could have been vested under the provisions of the Estate Acquisition Act, uh, lands uh, which has been uh, the lands which have been mentioned in the notice, mm. lands mentioned which has been mentioned. In the notice dated third October, twenty twenty three, can be said to have been vested under the provisions of the West Bengal Estate Acquisition Act. So date has to be decided after considering the submissions of the respective parties. Some of this court feels that the operation of such notice shall have to be stayed for. A limited period. First up, in view thereof, there shall be an order of stay of operation of the notice dated three ten twenty twenty three, which is appearing at pages one twenty three and one twenty four. Two notices, Mel. Two notices. Notices. Two mistakes. Two notices, which are appearing at pages one twenty three and one twenty four. One twenty four. One twenty three and one twenty four. Of this petition for a period of now uh, uh, till till the end of April twenty twenty four or until further orders, whichever is earlier. Uh, Mr. Government Leader, are you aware well, that uh, various uh, petitions, applications are pending before the Lanet Tribunal on this issue? I am not aware. Man. 
but is there any other repetition there might be five this is your lord there are at least my lord uh, 500 petitions have been filed before the tribunal that's why third one all the hard and bazaar in west bengal even if it is retained but that was not the intention in the pill matter that's a different thing altogether this best question best is there alta property lord <laughs> Man, regular matter. If they receive a notice, what the concern is, Man, if similar notices are being challenged before this court, and it goes before the single bench, there may be some inconsistent. Order. Yes, because that is the scheduled act, Man. That needs to go there. Now he has come here, but your lordship is taking up, Man. I am not standing in the way. That's why I took that. Point. Considering the larger, well, another thing, Man, that another thing is there. I am not standing, Man. This under the act, Man, scheduled that should go there. जजमेंट ऑफ दुप्रीम कोर्ट डिसीजन has to be taken taking your uh, or the highest <laughs> interpretation of the statutes and other things well it has to be taken at the highest level right, let us come back right? very good friend next real number 9 and let's see how appear for the petition i am for this i am appearing for response number 6 In this matter, also with the matter of the uh, PIL, I have complained about construction of boundary wall throughout the coastal area of Shankarpur. Yeah. So that will create a restriction to the visitors as well as the tourists to visit the coastal area of Shankarpur. The plot of land is in the name of the government, so government recorded land, but the fisheries department, in order to restrict the visitation right of the tourists as well as the local inhabitants. they are raising construction throughout this so that no person could enter into the uh, coastal area no how they can put a compound wall for the entire coast in the shankarpur coastal area no no not for the entire length probably for some restriction photograph says that there are a lot of houses nearby probably to protect the property they have put up the wall let them submit a report that they, they has not been constructed to restrict the Entry or visitors and right of the tourist as well as the local inhabitants. No, no, what is station right? Yes, what is your inception? Appearing for the status one. You are appearing for status one. Ah, uh, what is what is your inception? The construction is going on, my lord. There is uh, a huge, huge money. No, no. If the allegation is somebody cannot. Uh, what is your inception, sir? Uh, I am appearing for the private restaurant six. But in at page number twenty one, that is the record of right. It is recorded. I believe they are also using because they are the fishermen. We are also we are also being obstructed. Land was owned by the fisheries department, my lord. No, 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 no. Man, page number twenty-one. Land is in the name of the tourism department. Yes, not fisheries department. That page number twenty-one. But you have not given any representation to the. Which we have. Yes. yes. The representation no, 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 is to the police officer in charge. It should have been submitted with the uh, tourism or the fisheries department. Ah, yes. Your lordship can grant me liberty to approach the department and direct the department if such representation is made within a certain time. So which which authority we consider? They want to stop the proceeding. Construct Respondent the number four. Oh, three, four, five. Three, my lord. Three, four, five. This is development corporations. That is three, four, five. Two and three also. So the tourism department because the uh, tourism property is there. Okay. This uh, the by, by way of this public interest rate petition. Two and three. The petitioner uh, would submit that the respondents three to five okay. have started to construct a boundary wall near the coast area of Bay of Bengal at Shankarpur. Two a land. This is the coastal regulation. Representation. It is seen that before approaching the uh, this court by way of this rate petition. appropriate representation has not been given to the said authorities except for a complaint to the inspector in charge eh? except to a, a complaint to the police 
namely the seventh respondent. Therefore, this petition is disposed of by giving liberty to the petitioner to give a, uh, a proper representation to the appropriate uh, authority of the tourism department and the fisheries department along with a copy of this order. And if such representation is given, uh, the authority, the concerned authority shall deal with the representation and take a decision on merits and in accordance with law within a period of three weeks from the date on which the representation is submitted. Next. Real number Next. 10. No, I am for the minute private respondent. I'm at, uh, I'm the, the state respondent. I am the petitioner. Man. The petitioner is a public interest litigant, my lord. What has happened in respect of the block land and land reforms officer, Shonarpur, my lord, the private respondent is completely running the show. He's he's uh, posing himself to be a revenue officer. Mm -hmm. When Whenever uh, people come for change of nutrition, he's uh, taking money from them. He's changing the land land records. Uh, land records and with whom the, he? He's simply. A, he's uh, he's uh, according to me, he's not even an employee, not even a government employee. But he's running the run, running the entire show. Malad, I have received instruction from the legal advisor and nodal officer. Malad, the, they are in season of the matter. Malad, the director of land records and survey and land reform commissioner is already in season of the matter. Hmm. He is looking into the entire allegation and the related affairs, Malad. He is expected to Malad, kindly direct him with a time-bound frame to uh, file a report. Malad, who are you? Malad, my mother was what I in, Milad, in the Milad, office of the BDO, Milad. Milad, my mother was a ailing person. In some occasion, Milad, I went there to Milad, bring her home and Milad, assist him, assisted them, him, her Milad, to enter in the office. Milad, I have no occasion Milad, related with this case. Milad. Not only that, Milad, the allegation, bold allegation has been made. Milad, I am Milad, with Milad, some uh, changing of document, taking money. This is Milad, totally false allegation. Now he will ask for an affidavit. Milad, Track the matter. I'm just, just but been instructed. Your lordship, but may your lordship kindly see, be over. But your lordship you kindly see, will not the page number twenty-seven. No, suppose you are going to help your mother to reach the office. You better leave her in the office and. Please, come back. yes. Your no, no, in the office no. That is not. You are doing something. Malad, your lordship kindly see, will not page but twenty-seven. The instruction that I have received, my lord. It is the fifteenth February, twenty twenty-four. Even Malad, the anti-corruption department, Malad, they are even, they have referred the matter, the Deputy Inspector General uh, Department of Anti-Corruption Branch. They have referred the matter okay. to... The petitioner alleges... Uh, the one, but one one only... Nine indulgence, my seventh after the this, seventh uh, respondent, uh, who is not even a government employee, is virtually running the affairs in the office of the sixth respondent, namely the office of the Block Land and Land Reforms Officer, uh, Sonarpur. 24 this uh, Parganas South. In this regard, complaints have been given, and one such complaint has been taken note of by the Directorate of Anti Corruption Branch, West Bengal, and action has been initiated. The learned advocate appearing for the seventh respondent submitted that all the allegations made against him, uh, again, uh, made against the seventh respondent, are false. And that the mother of the seventh respondent is an employee in the said office. A contractual employee, you know, allegation I'm employee in the said office. And the seventh respondent used to uh, 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 drop her in the office and pick her up as she is uh, 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 suffering from certain ailments. In any event, if the seventh respondent is a, not an employee in the office of the Black Land and Land Reforms Department, he cannot enter the office nor handle any files nor discuss anything with any of the other staff in the office. Therefore, there will be a order restraining the seventh respondent from any man manner entering into the office of the Block Land and Land Reforms mm -hmm. Department, Sonarpur, 24 Pargana South District. Mm -hmm. And the authority concerned, namely the fifth respondent, shall proceed to investigate into the complaint, which is... Uh, which is already on its fight with the above observation this question is posted one one kind what? of indulgence my after this public interest litigation has been filed my lord i i have i have been i am receiving death threats my lord i have made a complaint if, if some protection is given i know that beyond the Malad, for police in action may i pray one indulgence 
the allegation and the complaint has been forwarded to the Milot Secretary Land Land and Land and Land Reform Department Milot. Milot bold allegation has been made against me. Milot, I am Milot face. I am face to Milot. Um, face to Milot any Milot investigation. But yes. but but subject to Milot but lawsuit correction. If Milot, it is found that Milot bold and false allegation has been made by the Milot. Petition I Milot. You should kindly give me liberty to Milot file. That Milot is already no. Is Milot because this is subject matter of the read petition Milot. I cannot file because no affidavit has been affirmed. Milot. May my instruction be kept to the record. Liberty can be given to file criminal defamation, Milot. If the Milot allegation is filed, Milot proof is to be false. Yes, sir. Serial number eleven. Eleven Milot. Uh, I beg to Milot appear for the petitioner. Yes. Millard, uh, this is a matter, Millard, where Millard, the election of the Shabhadipoti of the Siliguri Mahakuma Parishad, Millard, was called in question. Hmm. If Millard kindly text Millard, uh, my writ petition, page 23, hmm. the post for Shabhadipoti at the Siliguri Mahakuma Parishad, Millard, was reserved for a backward uh, category candidate, other backward class. Page 23, Millard would find at column 4, Shiliguri in bracket Millard backward class. Yes. And Millard, the person who has been subsequently elected and Millard presently holding the post, Millard, he is a general category candidate as per our instructions. Millard would turn over to page 25. Yes. Millard would find Orun Ghosh, serial number one, who is presently holding the post. He is a general category candidate. So that this is my allegation, Millard, that the person who is holding the post, Millard, is should be immediately declared as to be Millard uh, uh, disqualified or Millard declared to be dis disqualified what, for the what, post. What happened to your representation to the election commissioner? Millard, no, no, it is on page number 27 and it is addressed to the Secretary, Department of Panchayat and Rural Development. Can yes, P3? Which is page number 27, dated the 18th of December 2023. Now, the, now he has been elected. How yes. to throw him out of office. Millard, but if there is a question of initial disqualification, Millard, uh, then uh, you should have given it to the election commissioner. At that it is, point it is marked yes. to the election commissioner, Millard, page 29. No, Millard, no, no. no. Millard, Copy uh, marked is not. And at what time you can give this representation? Election. Can the election commissioner interfere now? Millard, this transpired, Millard, subsequently. Millard, it's a public interest litigation. Millard, uh, to the petitioner, Millard, it no, transpired. you are very late. So, Millard, uh, to, with deepest respect, Millard, uh, delay, Millard, if there is a question of initial disqualification of uh, this degree, Millard, delay, Millard, uh, won't be fatal, Millard, so, uh, to my deepest, uh, to uh, Millard, in my uh, respectful submission. Yeah, additional government call and also. The petitioner, by way of this public interest petition, alleges that the private respondent cannot hold uh, the office of Sabadivadi of the Siliguri Makamma Parishad, as he has suppressed the fact that uh, that he is a general category candidate and got elected to the concerned Parishad which is reserved for backward community candidate. At this juncture, the question of, and at this juncture, the election commissioner is precluded from taking any action in the matter. However, we find that a representation has been given by the petitioner to the First responding on 18-12-2023, which is shown to have been delivered in the office of the first respondent on 20-12-2023. Since the representation is yet to be considered, comma, without going to the merits of the allegations made by the petitioner, there will be a direction to the first respondent to consider the representation after notice to the concerned person notice to the fifth respondent and take a decision on merits and accordance with law and communicate the same to the petitioner within a period of eight weeks from the date of receipt of the server copy of this order. The petitioner is directed to enclose a copy of the representation along with a copy of this order 
and place the same in the office of the first responder to facilitate compliance of the above direction. Next. Great for Serial number 12. Yes. Well, I'm for responding number 9 and 10. Five responses. You lot I appear for the respondent number 7 and 8. The resident of Purulia, my lord, under Nothan to Gram Panchayat matter. And there is an allegation of siphoning of fund of the 15th Finance Commission. And he made kindly cover the office bearer of the Panchayat, my lord, Nothan to Gram Panchayat, my lord. Namely, my lord, Devas is part of who is the assistant and the and Nilmoni Chatterjee, he is working for daily month of that point. Mm. And, and another Kiyasuddin Ansari, GRS, and other staffs, my lord, they are, and has been siphoned in their name, my lord, as mentioning them as the agency, my lord. Kindly come to page 26, my lord. Nilmoni Chatterjee Agency. Nilmoni Chatterjee, my lord. And what is that agency? He cannot, he is a worker of the point, my lord. No, he cannot. No, so, these funds are sanctioned by the central government or state government? This is the rural, rural development, rural development department, rural development department. and in terms of the finance commission's recommendation. And, can you come to my lord? and what happened to your complaint? My lord, no, no inquiry has been made, my lord. Can you come to my lord? Page 27, my lord. Made complaint on 29th August 2023, my lord. Thereafter, my lord, made complaint on 9th September 20, 2000, 2023, my lord. Thereafter, my lord, made a mass petition, my lord. Page 32, my lord. Kindly come to my lord, page. No, no, this fund is sanctioned for rural rural development. Rural development, my lord. And it will be disbursed to whom will get the funds? The Ponchet staff, my lord. In their account, it is, it is, it is, account, it is diverse and said to the respective Ponchets for rural development. Okay. For different projects of government of India. Hmm. This, for, for that purpose, it is being written. Probably this agency may be a contractor. They cannot involve as a contractor, my lord. They are staff of the Ponchet, my lord. They, pa again, my they lord. perform the extra work, my lord. Private respondents. If, uh, respondent number 9 is the executive assistant of the Ponchet. And respondent number 10 is the contextual staff. They have performed the work, extra work, as the issued, notification issued by the video. This is the notification. As per sanction plan, respondent had performed the work. This allegation is frivolous and prayer B of uh, to A. Uh, Lord Sip can look, come to the prayer portion. Prayer B to A. They prayed for consider the representation and pass a reason order. No inquiry has been conducted by well, so far prayer my, B. So far my my experience was because I also come and from the original notification issued by the video. These are matters even That's if awesome works executed by the agencies, overall responsibilities of the panchayat to go in for audit. No. No proper audit, audit has been also conducted. They prayed for the consider the representation. They prayed for Lordship can you come to prayer B of the repetition. Prayer B to A. Let them find a report by the state violence. No, no, prayer B. No, no. This no. communication shows that the block development yes. officer has said yes. works must be properly monitored mm. and at the discretion of the pr Pradhan, extra remuneration for the yes. works may be paid yes. out of own funds or other contingency yes. funds available at the Gram Panchayat level. Yes. It is also to be noted that the payments to VLEs <laughs> be made on monthly basis. This yes. is a general circle. Yes. This allegation is you are an employee of the Panchayat. And you have taken away this money. No, no, my lord. I am not taken away. If your lord's money requires, I will file the affidavit. Lord, Last lord, part, extra remuneration of this works. Extra this remuneration of this work may be paid out of own fund or other contingency fund available at a GP level. Lord, the district magistrate and private is... respondents from from the... Lord, the district magistrate has the overall supervision under the Panchayat Act. Under the Panchayat Act. He has to file a report. Our delegate. They paid for the consider the representation. Prayer B. Lord Sip, can you come to prayer B? investigation alleges large scale misappropriation of the funds allotted by the government of India based on the recommendations of the 15th Finance Commission for rural development. 
the private uh, the respondents uh, uh, so the ninth respondent is the executive assistant of the panchayat and the tenth respondent is a contractual employee there are certain allegations made against those persons in this regard representation has been submitted to the various authorities stating that funds have been credited to the bank accounts of certain agencies which cannot be done at this juncture we cannot go into such disputed questions of fact as the matter is as, as the matter has already been brought to the notice of the authorities by way of a representation uh, the, what is the date of the representation representation dated last representation 611 611 2023 2023 it appears to be a mass petition therefore made by the uh, in this uh, matter, date, 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 direction to the fourth respondent to the matter. Date is also not there, my lord. No, so the, 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 in order to facilitate the same, the petitioner is directed to submit a copy of the representation along with other records, including a copy of this order, and submit the same in person to the in the office of the district magistrate Purulia, who on receipt of the same shall conduct an appropriate inquiry after notice to all concerned. Namely, the respondents uh, 7 to 10 and proceed to take action in accordance with law. The above direction will be complied with within a period of eight weeks on the date on which the representation is submitted in the office of the district magistrate. Next. Serial number 13. <laughs> And the other will co habitant of the area of the Chandana Sirampur Police Station municipality. They are enjoying the property without by cultivating the land infrastructure since long. Some of the property, even spot it costed. Now, the municipality decided and started construct started digging up upon my property below without notice, without giving opportunity of being hired. And how, do, how, how did you come into possession of that property? Any, any land I am mean, I'm, I'm submitting before Lord Sip. Lord, really speaking, Lord, the land declared as vested. And we Lord, we different persons, we Lord, final application for granting part time. Now, we Lord, they are enjoying the property. But who is the owner of the property? Owner, my Lord, the owner, the owner, my Lord, the owner, my Lord, the owner, the annexure has been made in this rich petition. Why has how it has been made in other persons, but the other person has not made a party in this rich petition. Well, all all annexation. No, Mahesh, Mahesh Housing. Mahesh Housing Cooperative Society. Ah, he you are encroached into that property. How you can, even if you are cultivating, my lord, the land is lying vacant. Declare the best state. Now, my lord, the unfortunately, you are not see the. There is no land record in support of. Well, 14, my lord, page 14. Yes, also can see page 14, annexation P1. For a moment, my lord. Annexation 14, annexation P1. My lord, we cannot be ousted, my lord, in this way, in this fashion, without due process of law. Uh, Without just, my lord. that they are all cultivating the land in without due process law, we cannot be evicted. Yeah, and there is a threat of summary eviction. The petitioner has not been able to point out any record to show. We well, cannot evict it in this in this fashion. possession of the property, and there is no land recorded to support the case of the petitioner. And merely because they are they are they entered upon the property illegally right. and are cultivating the property cannot confer any right on the petitioners. Therefore, we can. Last minute, the is there, my lord. Sorry, sir. Next. Serial number 14. Get full. My lord. 14. 14. 14. 14. My lord. I'll be supposed to. The matter relates to my lord. Forceful construction of a breeze over a canal which belongs to my lord. Government property. My lord, uh, on earlier occasion, there was a temporary structure of breeze. Now, my lord, that temporary structure was collapsed. After that, my lord, this my lord permanent structure of bridge, my lord has been my lord uh, constructing in a forceful manner, my lord, with the allegation that each and every person who may, who my lord use that bridge absolutely, so absolutely, my lord, incorrect. Uh, absolutely incorrect. Should my lord but pay the charges, is, which this, is not my lord, been, fixed by the government? This right, has been lord. constructed by an order, my lord. This is a juggler with the court, my lord, if I may say so, kindly. subject to correction, because the some of the person of the village. Came before here and moved the petition 
and the rate petition lot justice mantham lot of justice mantham single plan single bench passed an order and we have complied with the order the bridge has been is been constructed over the over there for the interest of at the at the base of the lot the public at large of the villages and if your lordship kindly see the report the tiny lot the second february who has constructed the bridge that is our allegation no, no, that is our allegation the, the government uh, authority no, no. kindly comment government authorities has given the permission report. Government authority has given the permission. P R I. Lord Chief, kindly see the report. That my lord, no permission was accorded, my lord, to construct the bridge. Lord Chief, kindly see the report. And my lord, the O C of. And if your lordship so desire, my lord, I can. I can find the affidavit on affidavit, my lord, annexing the documents. If your lordship so desire. In spite of this, this my lord, my lord. Hmm. Yeah, no. hmm. The last document, Lord Annex, Lordship, kindly see the order of this honourable court, dated Lord the third February, twenty seventeen. That bridge was collapsed. Hmm. So permission was granted to put up a temporary wooden bridge. No, Lordship, kindly see the order. Lord, kindly see the order. As per the report submitted by yes. The officer in charge. Kolaghat. 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 Let me let me get a copy, my lord. Uh, permission has been given by both the PRI bodies of both Pura Medinipur and Pashtim Medinipur. My lord. My lord. For construction of the bridge, and there was a writ petition also where that such a direction was issued. Therefore, the bridge has been constructed. My lord. May I get a copy of the my lord? You report. give one copy of that. Lord. Your score is the vector copy. After your complaint, they stopped the construction. Thereafter, the report was called for. And 2nd February 2024. And uh, BDO. Uh, yes, block Kolagad development. Has, I'm keeping uh, a, a memo. Uh, and he has questioned how, to, how they are constructed. And he has inquired. Inquired and blood. And uh, on inquiry, it has been communicated. Uh, plus, field inquiry was conducted. My lord. That both the PRI bodies of both the districts have given permission. I'm keeping a black one. The petitioner alleges that an illegal Hello, may I get a copy, my lord? Written instruction has been given to the learned ground creator from which it is seen that a field inquiry was conducted pursuant to the complaint given by the petitioner, and it has been found permission has been given by PRI bodies of both Purva Medinipur and Pashtim Medinipur district for construction of the said bridge. Therefore, there is nothing illegal about the construction of the said bridge for us to interfere. Question, this was. Next. Question. Question. Number 15. None. Well, my lord has been disposed of. Copy. I'm deeply obliged to know. Yes, 15. My lord, sir, appear for the respondent number 7. Eight, 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 I am for the respondent number 5. five. 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 Yes, yes, we remember. Respondents have been served. Five. And what happened to your complaint, sir? Whether the district magistrate has inquired into the complaint? Let's uh, may I just I am appearing for the tower installation company. Oh. My lord, the case has been made out as if my lord, mechanically my lord, the tower has been installed. My lord, there is a detailed guideline, my lord. May I just my lord, refer to? Before, before my lord, I take your lordship through the app guideline, my lord. My lord, we have to keep in mind, my lord, this is a public utility service. My lord, priority, my lord, serious priority, my lord, has to be given regarding the, my lord, FE, my lord, setting up of these towers. My lord, this uh, guideline, my lord, is called West Bengal Telecom Infrastructure Guidelines 2020 for clearance and permission to set up mobile tower or base tower station and laying optical fiber cable. 
well this guidelines postulates a detailed procedure for installation of the tower malad may i just my respectful submission malad the the guideline malad was followed in accordance with the malad uh, contemplation of these guidelines malad we have set up the tower i'll take your lordship through the relevant provision malad which shows according to you in terms of the guidelines you have got permission to my lord and you have put up the tower my lord that will appear from the noc malad kindly takes the malad the noc which is installed at malad which is the malad an extra page 48 and extra p4 and what what is your allegation my lord my allegation of complaint is प्रोसिजर for grievance redressal hmm. any person having some objection mallet which is that uh, mallet kindly takes 7b mallet b 7b mallet which is a page number page number 8 of the guideline wahan pe acha page 8 it on no it is mallet may please one second mallet clause 7 mallet rule 7 is the disposal of application or grant of permission by the appropriate authority Malad, there is a three-tier tier Malad uh, procedure: district level committee, state level committee, Malad state level appellate authority. So, Malad, these permissions are granted by district level committee, which comprises of experts from different Malad field. The composition I'll Malad show during the course of my submission. My humble so, submission, I, Malad, my instruction is this, Lordship, on behalf of state, that Malad, so far the nodal officer is concerned. Malad, this is the report of the nodal officer that after going through all the Malad the relevant documents and after having been obtained the permission, the nodal officer Malad, Malad eventually granted the. But after that, if any complaint is made with regard to that health hazards and other thing, then Malad, my Malad, the instruction, oral instruction is that that there is a district level committee, mm. and that district level committee, Lordship Malad, that is Malad headed by the district magistrate. and the concerned municipality or the corporation yeah. as, as the case may be one of the mem member number man let them malot approach before the district level committee where the district magistrate is the chairman or headed the committee so and that be disposed of my lord within a very specific period after giving an opportunity of hearing to all where the documents may be submitted by all i think my lord this is my submission lordship you know i am for the barashat municipality my lord my instruction is that we have not made any permission to of the installation of the mobile tower it is not despite that the pollution control board is a necessary party in the new guideline dated uh, 28 12 pollution control call for permission of the pollution control board is necessary let, let the district level let, committee yes, look into your district level committee we we'll looked into all these things my lord would come to page number 48 we annex here गाइडलाइन My Lord, this particular guideline, I mean, this particular paragraph concerns with government land, but this is a club premises, wherein a municipality and a, a, a school and a health center is housed. Mm. And my Lord, page number forty-nine, paragraph three, the person concerned states, "I have examined the reports received from local body." Barasat municipality says that no report has been given to them. Where from the opinion is formed. All right. Now, if the district magistrate is the part head of the, the committee, yes. he will examine. My lord, he can ask them to dismantle, or he can reject your uh, objection as baseless. He has got enough powers to do it. Municipality is also a member in that committee. Yes. They will put you on notice. Yours is a 
the several people in the locality have signed my Lord, my, my, so it's a sort of a mass petition my Lord. the tower company will also be heard in the matter my Lord. All right. My Lord, the district level committee district DLC. That to the erection of a mobile tower by the uh, private respondent namely the seven, uh, namely the seventh respondent alleging various illegalities uh, as pointed out by the learned advocate appearing for the seventh respondent the, the there is a regulation in place called the West Bengal Telecom Infrastructure Guidelines 2020 for clearance and permission to set up mobile tower or base tower station and laying of optical fiber cable. The Learned Government Council submitted that any aggrieved person would be entitled to approach the district level committee, which is headed by the district magistrate of the concerned district by way of a complaint, which will be examined on merits. Considering the allegations made in the red petition, since much of the facts are being disputed, these issues cannot be adjudicated in a red petition based on affidavits. Therefore, we grant liberty to the petitioner, uh, petitioners to file an application before the district level committee constituted for such purpose under the 2020 guidelines for North 24 Parganas district, along with a copy of this order. And on receipt of the uh, representation, the district level committee shall examine the same after notice to the petitioners as well as to the Barasat municipality uh, and the seventh respondent, Indus Tower Limited, uh, as well as the eighth respondent, which is said to be a club uh, in which premises the tower is proposed to be erected. Uh, the above direction be complied with within a period of three weeks from the date of receipt of the uh, petition before the district level committee. Next. Get, my Lord, get, may I pray that uh, no like, construction be done till my Lord, no, my Lord. Is, Lord. Lord. We can't, otherwise we can't do that. Give it to tomorrow. Next, next. My Lord, I beg to appear for the petition, my Lord. My Lord uh, Mr. Shurika Chatterjee is appearing for the state, my Lord. my Lord. He is on his legs before court room number 15, my Lord. I am praying for a short pass over. My Lord, if your Lordship may kindly comes to page 25, my Lord. Hmm. my Lord. We have the local villages, my Lord. They have made a representation before all the concerned authorities. My Lord, there is this ground, my Lord, government land. Hmm. My Lord, vacant government land traditionally being used as a playground mm. and occasionally, my Lord, holding of puja ceremonies. My Lord, suddenly we find that a tender has been, my Lord, issued for, my Lord, uh, giving uh, construction of boundary wall and converting into a, my Lord, Muslim burial ground. My Lord, this is a predominantly, my Lord, Hindu area. But in the land records, my Lord, what is the classification? Lord, it is classified as a uh, cover, cover stand. My Lord, when that classification... A burial ground. Burial ground. But when the classification has been made, we do not know because traditionally, because these are aged Maybe, people. Sir, aged people, my lord. my lord. Burial or cremation cannot be done anywhere as a person likes. It can be done only hand up your the places which have been earmarked for such my lords. So if this land has already been classified as a burial ground or as a graveyard, then unless you challenge that classification, probably nobody has uh, used it my Lord. for quite a long number of years. You have been using it as a playground. But unless the classification is challenged. My Lord, the other thing is, my Lord, there is, my Lord, nearby in the vicinity itself, there is another burial ground, my Lord. So, my Lord, there is no need at the time. At my Lord, the time problem was arise when they have started to give the boundary wall, my Lord. The PLRO has said that the LR plot number 203 measuring 0 0.93 acres, classified as Kabarsa, in the Mauza of Mistapur, so-and-so, etc., vested in the state by operation of law under the 1953 Act. So, unless you... Lord, have... Vesting, we do not... Uh, my Lord, we have admit challenge. that it... Ha... No, no, my Lord, vesting, we admit. My Lord, this is a vested land, government land. My Lord, traditionally being used as a playground. My Lord, suddenly, my Lord, if they... My Lord, uh, Create a boundary wall over the area, and my lord, it is converted into a my lord, 
burial ground well there would be well you want you challenge this classification traditional using see sometimes a private property will be left totally open people will be <laughs> passing through that it may be used as a road also kacha road how then uh, the petitioner can the representations that, have been made that, before that, the concerned authority long number Lord of years. kindly directs them to yeah, the extent of land was used as a playground by the local people and all of a sudden authorities are putting up a com compound wall and uh, converting into a muslim burial ground the learned government council has got written instructions which show uh, 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 which contained annexures including the report of block land and land reforms officer uh, dated 192024 which has stated that the land in lr plot number 203 measuring 0.93 acres has been classified as kabarsta in mouzam so and so so and so this year sir and was vested in favor of the state by operation of law as per the provisions of the west bengal its estates estates acts estates acquisition act 1953 full stop the the plot was classified as kabarstan in cs record huh? and the character of the land is continuing as kabarstan from the cs record to the present lr record in the light of the same huh? the fair sort for in the red petition cannot be exceeded this is next Video number seventeen. Mala, I'm uh, may I hand over the copy of this uh, the petition that real in the moja. So, Mala, yes, you give him a copy. Ma, they can if they want they can challenge. Next, but I am appealing for the government. May it is your lordship. I beg to appeal for the petition. Mala, this matter persons pertains to. Mala, before your lordship, Mala, he makes submission. My humble submission is this is not an application under public interest litigation. The lordship will kindly see paragraph. Three. The private respondent would de deprive the petitioner or other public at large of his fundamental Sir, rights. Let me satisfy your lordship. The respondent. What is the relief you want? Cancel the. My lord, license. My, my lord, let me. The respondent number eight mm. is runs a fair price shop at the village, my lord. Mm. Which provides the rationing things like a uh, rice and other. But stuff. now that shop is of no significance. Ration is coming. Do are do are ration? My lord, no, there is my lord. It's not pertinent to that. That since two thousand twenty, from the outbreak of COVID nineteen, the particular this fair price shop which run which gives food to the throughout the whole village is now giving food in, in under the shortage. Short, they are giving a shortage of quantities, my lord. We have raised complaint before various authorities. We have even given a mass petition by by the fellow residents. And the eighth respondent is giving. Uh, uh, there is a shortage of quantity of all the quantity all all the products, my lord. All the fair price product, my lord. We have sure. raised complaint. There has been no steps taken against him. There has been. We have even given a mass petition, my lord. No steps has been taken against him. And the what whole village, my lord, Chief, stand is very clear, my lord. There is one point of my lord maintainability also, lord, Chief, because lord, Chief knows, my lord, we have a roster group eight which deals with essential commodities. My lord, have already seen, lord, Chief, that principal pair is cancellation of license. So, my lord, if there is a statutory remedy, my lord, on which Supreme Court is very much clear, but, uh, lord, Chief, I'm lord, Chief. So, my lord, peel is not peel for my lord all the my lord's wrongs, my lord. Lord Chief, there is a judgment. Lord Chief, may I please? Yes. It is a flood. Okay. Clause twenty-four of the West Bengal PDS order specifically provides me not for a. Give me the books. Mm -hmm. Lord Chief, clause twenty-four of the West Bengal PDS maintenance and control order twenty thirteen. Me Lord, clearly stipulates how to do that. Uh, if a licensee or his or her agent or any other person acting, may I hand over? Lord I, Chief, I've Lord. got two books. I'm giving. Lord Chief. Hmm. So, Milord, we have a roster, group 8, Milord. If any inaction, Milord, then Milord, it has to be agitated. All right. No, Milord. what happened to his complaint? Complaint, Milord, is it the... Complaint is not before the statutory authority itself. No, no. Complaint, complaint is before the been... police initially in 2020 sure. and now in 2023. But uh, now that the scheme has been altered and you are delivering the no. uh, ratio... No. No. At the full, at the, the good door stage. Now let me kindly come down to page number thirty. Well, Lord, he is harping upon the complaint of twenty twenty one isolated event during the period of COVID, which has been inquired into, Milord, and Milord grievance stands redressed 
even till today, Milan, may I place the report lordship? This is the first question on maintainability. May I just Milan place this clause 24 of the order of that 2013? Right, and Milan, one judgment, Milan, may I just Milan respectfully, Milan, hand over this copy of the judgment, Milan, Milan 2014, Milan, 5 SCC, Milan, 530, 3 judgment of the Honorable Apex Sword, Milan, may I, Milan, straight away, Milan, take your lordship, Milan, lordship, Milan, to para, para, Milan, 49 lordship. 49 Millard, may I respectfully invite you, Lord Shimmel, last four lines Millard or paragraph Millard, 49 Lord Shakes. Mm. When their interest can be protected and our controversy or the dispute can be adjudicated by a mechanism created under a particular statute, the parties should be relegated to the appropriate forum instead of entertaining the petition filed as public interest litigation, Millard. This is one of the observations. Secondly, Millard, if your lordship is not with me, Milord, with the, on the issue of Milord maintainability, may I, Milord, Milord, address on the factual aspect of the matter. Milord, his complaint is of 2020, that is during which my COVID, raging COVID was, was in vogue, Milord. Milord, we had, Milord, undertaken, Milord, no, as many as three inquiries, Milord, on the on this aspect of the matter, lordship. May I, Milord, respectfully, Milord, hand over, Milord, this copy of the reports. Just may I, Milord, respectfully invite to the relevant Pages what, of what is the outcome of the inquiry? There is no such, Milord. Even the mass petition which he is harping upon, some of the Milord's signatories say, Milord, even we are not, Milord, holding a ration card with that particular FS, or, uh, FS shop. Only signatures have been obtained, Milord. Then paper. May I straight away take <laughs> your lot right. Milord? Then paper, you will only find my instruction. One, two, three, they, four, they have only cards at that particular fair price shop. That is, Milord, straight away. As pay. on date, as on date, if there is a problem, <laughs> you go under twenty uh, control order. Clause twenty four. Twenty four. Class twenty four of the control order. If you file a petition along with the adequate, but now it is not happening because now it is coming to your doorstep. You can see the measurement being. Done Milo, even at the doorstep, also this particular fair oh, type no. dealer is also. Oh, no, Lord Shri Miller, may I just refer me as. All right, by this election, the point of the public interest is that the petitioner he is taking the produce of also. supply of ration products uh, by the fair price shop and uh, established by the. Uh, no, I said I got isolated by the H respondent. Was one grant over in the Dutch Ocean on 2020. The respondent raised an objection as regards the maintainability of the petition. Since if the petitioner wants the cancellation of the fair place li license granted to the eighth respondent, come on, it, the, ma the matter should be classified under group eight and should be heard by the learned single bench. Further, the Dalai government council points out in terms of clause 24 of the West Bengal PDS, will bracket maintenance and control order 2030, uh, uh, power have been granted to take action against the licensee for committing irregularities and uh, and uh, uh, and uh, if an appropriate complaint is given to the appropriate authority the same will be looked into the learned government council also submitted uh, also placed reliance on the decision of the honorable supreme court in jaipur shah so and so 2014 4 5 scc 530 uh, for the proposition that if there is a mechanism created under a particular statute, the party should be relegated to the appropriate forum instead of entertaining a writ petition filed as a public interest litigation. That apart, the the written instruction given to the um by to the learned government advocate by the subdivisional controller within bracket F and S Serampu Hoogli. Mm -hmm. shows that the complaint and the mass petition were inquired into and nothing adverse had turned out of the same. Furthermore, the allegation was uh, said to have happened in the year 2020 during the period of COVID pandemic. Further, the Learned Government Council submitted that the present system of uh, distributing uh, ration items has been changed and now ration articles are delivered in the doorstep of the public. In the light of the same, we find no grounds to issue any direction as sought for in the reflection dismissal. Next. Serial number 18. Mother, item 18, Mother, I am for the petition. I may take back the books, my Lord. Yes. Mother, paragraph 3, I have stated my, my identity. I am for the respondent number 10. Mother, identity 
that the petitioner before your lordship is a my lord reporter hmm. my lord in support of them ps 23 ps report if... certificate from government of west bengal my lord against now my lord the big fact of the case is that against the respondent number 10 hmm. who is a teacher of a madrasa hmm. as well as a elected member of jila parishad three tier panchayat system jila parishad hmm. and karmadokko of my lord not 24 parguna of jila parishad but he with you my lord salary from school as well as jila parishad my lord two times my lord simultaneously for last 10 years my lord i lodged my lord the no if he is elected member he cannot hold any office of profit yes my lord that is my my lord by i i i need my lord notification you are appearing school so. teacher he is drawing the salary from the school with the permission of the uh, uh, education department but he is not drawing any single paisa from the panchayat department so per my instruction public can be a child state in state in state state not appearing I, i think shaishandu bandobad is appearing for the state you served notice today in the office of the government leader huh? already i served my lord again my lord the learned advocate for the petition yes, is directed to serve notice in the office of the yes. learned ground feeder so yes. as to yes. enable them to get instruction for the respondents 1 to 8 list the matter next week in the same in the admission list my lord next week in the admission list my lord get full your lord next serial number 19 get full my lord yes. Uh, Your Lordship, I am appearing for the petition. Your Lordship, petition is the depositor in respect of the Ponzi scheme floated by the private respondents. Your Lordship, hmm. the, the petition and the pro forma respondents. Your Lordship. we have re uh, made a representation but there is one division bench which is dealing with ponzi matter yes your lordship it, this so will not go be assigned uh, well, your lordship may kindly assign to them assign it to the ponzi bench all right naam to diye to since the case concerns an allegation of uh, running a ponzi scheme come on we deem it appropriate that the matter should be placed before the honorable division bench dealing with such ponzi scheme matters accordingly the matter is released from the list and the papers be placed before the honorable chief justice no i can't say i'm the one the chief justice for no oh, but chief justice for the assignment get full next serial number 20 lord 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 with bill and submit him lord Lord, how many years complete, Lord? Can you register for the state? State. Is there a certain state? Is there a certain state? How is it happening? Lord, Lord, this matter. Because today morning it was served, my Lord, as a lead matter, my Lord. You are appearing for all the respondents. Lord, I am appearing for all the state respondents, not the Madrasa, Your Lordship. Madrasa has not been served. Lord, part has not been served. I will have told you. West Bengal Madrasa Service Commission. And, and what is the prayer is against the service commission commission lord com board and commissar as well as state also lord mandamus illegality lord finding the respondents illegal. also not to grant further extension lord against the illegal ship i challenge the maintainability of this pil your lordship pardon my lord i challenge the maintainability of this pil my lord i say it cannot be termed as a public interest litigation your lordship my lord first of all they have not stated what is their locus and my lord there is nothing my lord which has infringed their right or has affected the public at large there is particularly my lord an allegation against a particular person my lord that is some personal interest of some person has been my lord uh, not been given effect to this is my lord his allegations my lord and so far as the uh, Sec, the representation, my lord, which they have annexed regarding that, my lord, that has been acted upon. The uh, the government of West Bengal, my lord, has sent this representation to the proper department, my lord. May I hand over the copy of that instruction to your lordships? My lord, actually, my lord, he is my lord after his retirement, my lord, taking the my lord his my lord scope, my lord, uh, extension of service, my lord, after his my lord after the my lord retirement, my lord, 
second lot for me no illegal activity in lot that is no your representation is receiving consideration that, that is that is there ah, the petitioner uh, by way of this public interest litigation seeks for a direction upon the respondents not to uh, grant further extension to the ninth respondent with the post of director of madrasa ah. education government of west bengal the learned government council appearing for the state raises an objection regarding maintainability of this petition as a public interest litigation since the allegations are directed against a private person and the petitioner has not in any manner established as to how his constitutional rights have been affected be that as it may as could be seen from the instruction given by the as could be seen from the communication sent by the deputy inspector general of police directorate of anti corruption branch west bengal dated 23 2023 the complaint given by the petitioner has already been forwarded to the secretary government of west bengal minority affairs and madrasa education department uh, uh, since the matter has for been forwarded only on 23 2023 the uh, petitioner has to await a decision to be taken by the concerned department They, there will be a, therefore there will be a direction to the secretary government of west bengal minority affairs and madrasa education department to look into the complaint and consider the same and take a decision and communicate the same to the writ petitioner hmm, within a period of 8 weeks from the date of receipt of the server copy of this order next serial number 21 here that we have not gone into the merits of the well i for the statement item 21 Lord, petitioners are the villagers of the locality concerned, my lord, who use the pathway of the, of the maintained by the gram panchayat, my lord. The private respondents, my lord, illegally started construction over the encroaching the pathway, my lord. Any any photograph you got? My lord, one yes, title suit is pending, my lord. My lord, there is their Indian same Indian. cause of action has been taken. Yes, my lord. And they are a party. And they were the parties, and it is a yet to be decided whose land it is. A private dispute, my lord. My lord. In in that title suit, my lord, there is an injunction order, my lord, injected. So how you we can entertain? Them. Now they try to enforce the, um, that not, order not before your lordship. Construction over the. So therefore, you file an application under the. We uh, approach before the panchayat authority, my lord. Not, no, this is not. Uh, we approach before the panchayat authority, my lord. Petitioner alleges. And local inspection also happened. Private respondents have illegally made a made a construction but in a public place. But. Page forty. And rightly pointed out by the learned advocate for the state, title suit is pending between the parties, and uh, uh, parties, and the petitioner is also uh, parties, and uh, there is also there appears to be an order of injunction granted by the civil court. Thus, it, thus unless and until it is established that the land is a public land, come the question of granting uh, any direction would not arise. Therefore, at this juncture, we are not inclined to entertain this public, this writ petition as a public business. Next, next. Serial number twenty-two. But serial number twenty-two. I am appearing for the state. Yes, my lord. I am for the petition. For the private respondent. That relates to my lord encroachment of government pathway. My lord, may kindly come at page fourteen. The my lord. My lord. Malad similar to page number twenty-one. Similar to page pending. Self serve cause of action. My lord, uh, learned trial judge passed an order. Well, civil civil cause of action, civil suit is pending, and my lord, my lord justice. Come at page fourteen, my lord. My lord, can have a look for a moment. Okay. My lord, two seven five seven classification of land is. My lord, my lord, three of the, the petition are filed. Abad rock ko jata hai ta jono sorbo sadaron. Civil suit is pending, my lord. And my lord, I have also annexed my lord photographs at page sixteen. My lord, they have blocked the pathway by constructing my lord a uh, brick brick wall, my lord. That is the whole difficulty. My lord, have they a have the my lord. They may have their landed property over the same plot of land, but my lord, they, the private respondent is not at all entitled to my lord block the my lord common pathway. My lord, we are using that common pathway, my lord, since long, my lord, years after years. Now, who is this red petitioner? Your claim? my lord, red petitioner is the private respondent here. Oh, and my lord, three of the petitioner, my lord, they they have filed their appeal matter. They, they were the party in the said proceedings which and my lord which three petitioners my lord three petitioners namely my lord uh, konika haldar uh, who was the uh, respondent number 8 in the earlier writ petition hmm. 
Champavati Singh, who was the respondent number five in the red petition, and Srimoti Singh, who was the who are, was the uh, respondent number six in the red petition. But I'm, not I'm only that, Srimoti Singh was the uh, petitioner of the title suit, which was dismissed on contest. Thereafter, the preferred appeal appeal is pending. Not only that one report, my lord, kindly have a look on the report uh, filed by the BL and LRO. But you have not mentioned my lord, the my lord they have suppressed all the material facts. Kindly have a look in the order passed by the, uh, in the read petition, page 54, for a moment, my lord. Ukta dagduitir majhe noxadriste kono bandnai, shorjamine kono albandnai, Recorde Sadharone Jatate Jono Beboharjo Ulek Nai Dagduiti Rayoto Ebung Sali Jomi Bisoiti Badipo Ker Jatate Barampote Prostuni Asena. My Lord, put me fine. Higher, higher, my Lord, but may I may I just submit for the state? My Lord, it would come whether it was my pathway or complete yes. simple yes. system in close or not. Yes. 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 What happened? Yes, but what happened? My this is absolutely a private dispute. What happened? There is a first of all, my Lord, this. Public interest litigation is not maintainable on three four grounds. Number one, my lord, the private respondent initially filed a writ application against the present writ application, writ petitioner, and order has been passed by the coordinate single bench. Uh, honorable single bench. Now, what happened? There are civil suit is pending. The civil court, my lord, the plain petitioner before last she lost, then appeal is pending. Now, my lord, if you permit, my lord, I can show the report, my lord, no, it, it, is here. And it, before. it is here. By this public but the police report will say it is absolutely public. Private dispute yes, between yes, the parties. Yes. Uh, by this public interest, uh, by this petition, public interest petition, by ten petitioners, they allege that the private respondent, namely the ninth respondent herein, illegally like put up a wall uh, in a public pathway. The learned advocate appearing for the ninth respondent pointed out that that uh, a red petition was filed hmm, um, by by the ninth respondent. By the ninth respondent in in WPA one forty nine thirty three of twenty twenty three, in which the red petitioners one eight and ten were respondents, and the red petition was disposed of uh, uh, after uh, after. Uh, perusing the report of the block land and land reforms officer. Apart from that, the court also took note of the fact that a title suit is pending. It is, it is seen that the 10th writ petitioner, Srimati Singh, wife of Radhanath Singh, was the plaintiff in title suit number 89 of 2006 on the file of the Court of Civil Judge within bracket junior division, Karthik Kama South 24 Parganas, and the suit was dismissed by judgment dated 23 12 2019, as against which appeal is now, appeal is still pending. Appeal is pending. These facts have been completely suppressed by the writ petitioners, hmm? uh, uh, more particular writ petitioners, particularly writ petitioners number 1, 8, and 10. Thus, considering the fact that there is civil litigation pending between the parties and there was also an earlier order of the writ petition, this writ petition cannot be entertained as a public interest litigation and therefore it is dismissed. And the writ petitioner number one, Kakina Halda, writ petitioner number eight, Champapati Sinha, and writ petitioner number ten are directed to pay a cost of rupees 10,000 each to the District Legal Services Authority, South 24 Parganas, within a period of 15 days from the date of receipt of the copy of this order. Next. Serial number 23. Red Fuller. Yes. Lord Shri, I am praying for today's accommodation, Lord Shri. I have a copy of my Lord. I am for the response number 23. Response number 1. Word. Your client will have a copy. Lord Shri, regarding 23, I am praying for today's accommodation, Lord Shri. Advocate record is... I am for the response number 1. Word. Illegally occupied government land, illegal business, earning black money. No island could not be constructed at so and so crossing, etc. What what is the illegality going on? Not aware, Lord Actually, no, no, no. We can't adjourn, sir. 
unwanted regular accidents in nh41 cross due to encroachment of corners you are for the i for the union of, union of india for the national highways who sir i am appearing for the national highways authority he says there is some free like some uh, representation is pending lordship sir lordship can dispose of these representations my lord and who will do it actually my lord made this advocate authority. record is ill he has not come to the court lordship that is why i am the third respondent my lord my lord the, the petitioner's grievance is that there are frequent yeah. accidents uh, in a particular area in nh41 crossing due to encroachment of the corners uh, in this regard mass petitions have been given to the authorities more particularly the authorities of the national highways authority of india and since no action had been initiated on those uh, uh, representations this petition has been filed um we have heard the learned advocates appearing for the respondents so bore na kar uh, since we are discussing of this petition without calling for affidavits the merits of the allegations are not drawn into but there will be a direction to the third respondent the project director nhai kolkata to consider the representations given by the petitioners and take appropriate action in accordance with law uh, the in order to facilitate uh, accordance with law within a period of Three weeks from the date of receipt of the copy of the representation, the petitioner is directed to uh, appear in person before the third respondent and uh, and uh, furnish copies of the representation along with a copy of this order to enable the third respondent to comply with the above direction. This post of next serial number twenty four. Well, I am for UGC. Yes. Yes, sir. I am for UGC. I am being led by Mr. Nilendu Bhattacharya. I am seeking a short pass over if you. He is here. is on mr nilendu bhattacharya nilendu bhattacharya what is the matter yes sir lordship your lordship this matter is with regards to the appointment of one ranjan sen who is the private respondent number 4 your lordship if your lordship remembers See, there was a earlier writ petition on yes your lordship we had withdrawn that writ petition my lord and if, uh, that uh, uh, okay. matter my lord and we have filed a fresh yes, by adding the Not private respondent not for on the ground of non availability of senior 3 weeks next Serial number twenty five. Serial number twenty five. Yes. Appearing virtually, my lord. My lord. In two thousand six, the Honorable Supreme Court in a my lord uh, decision, direct some direction was given regarding my lord the conservation of the forest area. Was it ten or no? Now, my lord, if your lordship kindly turn to page hundred and one. Yes. A notification was issued on twenty second September twenty twenty hmm. that the uh, environmental zone declaration of environmental zone and my lord, if you lot to kindly turn to page one zero six. Hmm. Regarding my lord, the commercial mining, spoon quarrying, and crushing unit. Now, my lord, there is a clear prohibition. within the uh, the national park and the sanctuary regarding mm. the mining of uh, any kind of mining operation now malat here malat the petitioner complains of regarding malat the sand quarry within the mohananda wildlife sanctuary and malat the most surprising fact that the uh, i malat the if your lordship kindly come to page 78 the district land and land reform officer he granted permission in favor of the private respondent regarding query of the sand mining matter and malad uh, in connection with this 2006 judgment in to, to 2022 the honorable supreme court issued a guideline my malad my uh, junior associate is there malad you will hand over malad the judgment which is reported in 2022 volume 10 scc 544 If your lordship kindly come, the relevant paragraph, which is that, was there any earlier writ petition on the yes, same? Malad, there, was a, there was a there was an earlier writ petition, my lord, wherein, my lord, wherein the state, my lord, the learned council for the state submitted that some there are some permissions granted by the authority, and your lordship was pleased to uh, dispose of the writ petition, granting liberty to me. Mm. Malad, the challenging the permission granted by the state authority. Mm. Malad, if your lordship kindly consider the decision of the honourable Supreme Court, wherein, all right, we'll examine. 
So first you have to establish that this particular uh, sand mining or uh, removing of boulders is within the prohibited distance mm -hmm. and is hit by the uh, Ministry of Environment. Mm -hmm. yes. Namala, kindly come. Let them get instruction. You get appropriate instruction at the request of learner advocates appearing for the respondent. As well as the state also. State also. Next. Number 26. Malad, may I permit it to? Affidavit of service. Affidavit of service kept on record. Grateful, Malad. But I have for the state. 26, my lord, I am for the petition. Hmm. Uh, my lord, in this case, the service could not be completed as, as one of the respondents could not be served as it is shown that insufficient address. Contable, correspondent. You, you uh, take out fresh notice. Yes, okay. that is to the eighth respondent because sir is appearing for the state respondents. Well, I tell you, Lordship, this is the case. Uh. Well, as I when lawyer appears, well, they have a duty as an officer of the court. Correct. Well, an order was passed by this bench hmm. on the basis that this property belongs to the land belongs to the irrigation department, hmm. which is absolutely wrong. It was on the basis of assertion made in paragraph 3, similar assertion made at page 3, paragraph 3. And the land belongs to which department? Collector. And my lord, your lordship directed the irrigation SDO to hear and to demolish. He cannot demolish. Of course, he has taken step and hearing has been made. Now it has... No, he can refer the matter to the... No, my lord will direct the additional district magistrate... Uh, of the district to take steps in terms of Malad, no. Unauthorized Occupant Act 1969. But he, they have not given any representation to the additional district magistrate. Let them do that. Because your lordship knows, Malad, under Land Reforms Act, Malad, if the riot and the others are there, but under the Malad, public public Premises Unauthorized Occupant Act, kindly sees. I have one, one copy, Justice Bhattacharya will my lord excuse. Section 4. The order was, sec order was secured as if the land is irrigation land. Irrigation department's land, and your lordship rightly passed that order because of the assertion made in the writ petition. But now it is under the control of the collector. Collector. I have got the record of right which he has not annexed in respect of the property. Page 6. This is the second time the petitioner is before this court by way of a public interest litigation. Earlier, WPFE 584 of 2023 was filed, alleging that the eighth respondent therein was putting up Ill illegally putting up construction in a water body. The writ petition was disposed of by order dated 12-12-2023. Uh, um, directing the fifth respondent, namely the irrigation department, Fifth respondent therein, the irrigation department, uh, to take action. And the block land and land reforms officer was directed to give adequate assistance. The Learned Government Council submitted that the submission made in the earlier petition is incorrect. And the land does not belong to the irrigation department, but it is a land, government land under the control of the district collector. It is, un it is the land uh, under collector of the district. Uh, uh, control of the uh, district collector. Collector of the district collector. Therefore, if any action has to be taken on the uh, on the complaint given by the petitioner, it is the district collector slash district magistrate who has to... In terms of that act, my lord. Uh, who has to initiate action in terms of the public land within bracket eviction of unauthorized occupants, bracket close act 1962. The light of the above. The writ petition is disposed of giving liberty to the petitioner to file an appropriate representation before the district magistrate slash district collector of South 24 Parganas, mm -hmm. uh, along with copies of the earlier representation and other documents, along, as well as a copy of this order, so as to enable the district magistrate slash district collector.
to examine the representation on merits and in accordance with law. The above direction shall be completed with as expeditiously as possible, preferably within a period of 12 weeks from the date on which the representation is given. Yes, sir. Deeply obliged. Great for Lord Chief. No. We'll stop with this. Before your leadership rise, there will be specially fixed. Madam, let your leadership take up two people. Now, one more thing on indulgence on second line is extreme urgency 26. But to, to, at around 12,000 candidates' candidature in Madras Service Commission has been cancelled on films ground. Right? We have taken leave of just. Well, I am for the Madras Service, Service Commission. This is uh, absolutely a wrong statement. Uh, in 20, oil, June 23, Malad will be intimated. Uh, 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 that you my are disqualified. Prayer else, my prayer is Malad. Kindly ask me. Absolutely. Malad, for us prayer. Malad, Malad.